What's going on, guys? Good morning. Sean Kraut, what's up, Tim? Mikey, Alex, Wrestler Shoe, Chris Johnson, and Jose, what's up, man? Yeah, good morning, good morning. Yo, uh, grab the link to the chat, help me out. Uh, share it on Reddit, Weeble Chat. Wherever you talk about stocks, I would appreciate it. Hit that like button, and we're going to get going here, all right? Uh, we did have a little dip early morning, but we recovered back up to this zone here. I'm trying to get caffeinated, so let me get this cup of coffee, and I'll be right back. Give me 30 seconds. Yeah, right, I'm back. Yeah. Uh, look at some rockets in the chat, guys. Can we get some rockets up in the chat? What's up, 730 Radio? What's up, man? Yes, if you're here and you're listening, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and uh, hit that notification bell, get notified when I go live. Let's get some rockets in the chat, all right? What's up, Sherry Baker? Good morning. Sherry, whenever you're ready, let me know, Sherry. All right. Uh, yeah, just let me know. I'm trying to get going here, guys. I'm trying to wake up. I'm sorry. All right. Uh, so far, Microvision uh, for the day down 0.58%. Pretty much break even. Pretty much break even. Ethereum's popping off. $3,134 on its way to that new ATH. AMC up 1.16%. And NEO up 0.65%. There we go. Yeah, the nice little jump here. 1539. Nice little blue candle. We had the dip already. And uh dip down to about 1508. I did tell you guys I expected a dip this morning. All right. Thumbs up in the chat if you remember me calling out the dip. I said we were gonna dip this morning, and it was quick. It was quick. We dipped down to about 1508. Uh almost down here to structure. Pretty close. Pretty darn close. Came to about right here. Right over here where this action is over here. It came down and bounced off. We might come back down again. I don't know. But we might. We actually might come down to about 1485. That's kind of where I thought we were going to go. Uh, so we'll leave this little zone in here. But I think maybe, possibly, it does still come down a little bit more. But we'll, we'll see. Yeah. Uh, dip, dip. Yes, it might. It very well may do that. Yeah, let me, uh, grab, let me grab the link here real fast. Give me one second here. Yeah, I'm typing in Weeble Chat right now. I'll type in Weeble Chat right now. One second. Yeah, there we go. All right. Yeah, where are we at? Who's in here, man? Uh, Dax Dog Wrench, what's up? Stock picks and more. Let's go. Yeah, let's go, man. All right, we're down below this little zone here. All right, we did uh, come come back down to the zone, and uh, I knew this, I knew this was gonna happen this morning at some point. Uh, we didn't dip that far yet. Hopefully, we don't have to go any lower. But if we do, we do have some structure down here, and it's 50 SMA. One hour time frame, looking like uh, this golden cross is coming up, so that's good. Yeah, right. Uh, oh, man. Okay, here comes the dip. Here comes the dip. Here comes the dip. Probably coming down to structure, guys. Maybe come down to 1485. And then bounce. We got the 200 SMA right here. But we are going to bounce at some point, all right? Because we do have this golden cross. 
that looks like it's about to happen. Uh, maybe not even today. It might not happen today on this one hour time frame, but it likely will happen uh, sometime in the next uh, couple days. Yeah, let's go, Charles Chiz. Let's do it. I did call for this dip. I told you guys if you're gonna if you're trying to get in Mavis, don't do it this morning. Not not early. Let this thing dip. All right, we had a really nasty run, and I did tell you guys probably would have a dip today. All right, so here we are dipping down to structure right now, pretty close to it. Maybe we come down to the 200 SMA. Maybe we just come to 1485. I don't know exactly how far we're gonna go. I can't predict it like that, but. I do think, uh, you know, a dip down here the structure is healthy, and it's obvious that it was going to happen, so here it is. Here it is. Here's your here's your dip, Mavis. Josh Screamer says, I wouldn't sell, I wouldn't set, I wouldn't sell at a loss on these stickers unless you need free cash flow. Yeah, no, for sure. Uh, Stock Picks and More says, Mavis, remember guys, this was less than a dollar 18 months ago. You don't lose unless you sell. That's a fact. That is a fact, my friend. Yeah, that is a stone cold fact. All right, finding some uh, support here around uh, fourteen ninety one. I'm six cents away with the call. Oh, if it goes any lower, I don't know, but six cents. I'll take six cents. That's pretty accurate. Yeah, that's pretty good. We need to get back above the zone. This is going to be uh, a nice little move. We get back above the zone in the next couple uh, hours, maybe maybe minutes. Who knows? Close and then make a move to the upside. Sixteen twenty two is the next. Wall up here, we're going to need to get above, all right? 1622. Let's check RSI on the 15-minute time frame. RSI is uh, about 47, so nice little dip here. Price holds up above the structure zone, structure level, I should say. We're in for a rip, guys. We're in for a rip if we hold up. It's always good to see RSI uh, fall off and price hold strong, so that's what we want. that's what we want to have happen here. Oh crap, I forgot to share it in the stream in the I shared it in the wrong dang place. Guys, I totally revamped the Discord. If you guys like uh the Discord, let's get a thumbs up in the chat. If not, thumbs down, that's fine. Uh I did spend a lot of time on it. I kind of did just go crazy with it, but I wanted it to look nice, you know. It seemed a little boring and I just wanted it to be nice. So uh I feel like it looks good. I, I'm going to move some of this stuff to the public zone. Uh, I did think about that, and I'd like to keep the members-only zone uh, relatively smaller. So I'm going to move uh, some of these things up to the public chat so people have stuff to do in there, too. If they decide to join the members, cool. If not, that's completely fine. All right, nice, nice, nice here recovery here back in the zone. Man, we dipped right down here where I said, guys. It's crazy. It's crazy. Sometimes I like to pat myself on the back, all right? Sometimes. Feels good to be pretty right. Pretty close, guys. 1491. I was six cents away with my line here. Pretty close. All right. Pretty darn close. Yeah, back up in the zone now uh, at 1520 right now. So maybe uh, we get a little rip here. Or it comes down a little more. I don't know. But it looks like, uh, you know, the day traders took their profits there. Yeah, where are we at? Giving, giving a bunch of gamblers a 24 hour casino. Hey. You know what? That thing is addicting, even though it's text. I was probably playing the crap out of that thing. Yeah, it's super fun. Yeah, I had a good time. I lo I ran it up to 100,000 and then lost it all. <laughs> it sounds about right. <laughs> sounds about right. Yeah, you guys, you can buy gems, so you know, if you want to spend real money, you can. But, uh, yeah, you can also get free, um, free credits with that, just... Doing plus wheel every 22 hours, so you can spin the wheel. Yeah, all right, let's check. Uh, let's check Fintel real quick. Yeah, let's check Fintel. I'm what AMC. I'm at Mavis. Four hundred thousand on Fintel, guys. I'm gonna sign up for Ortex uh, pretty soon, so we have Ortex data as well. Yeah, I'm tired of not having all that stuff, and uh, I got to get the login to this. I do have a um, the paid subscription to this. Somebody sent me the login, and I just got to figure out what it was because I forgot. So I'll figure that out uh, today after the stream. That way, going on, we have Ortex and uh, the paid version of Fintel. We have, we have some more data. Yeah, but right now, 400000 available. Sandra Lay, good morning, Sandra. Still reading that Naked Forex book, Josh Screevers. Nice, nice, nice. Hell yeah. 
Charles Chiz Huntington, thank you for the five dollar super chat, my friend. Starting off strong. Thanks for the calls. I was able to drop my average from 18s down to two dollar, down to two dollars, fourteen twelve. Wait, average down on your calls. Oh, okay, okay, your calls. Gotcha. Nice man. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, I appreciate the super chat, brother. Thank you. Yeah, thank you very much. Yeah, I gotta see why this event list isn't working. Did that work? Yeah, did that work? There it goes. Yeah, there you are, Chiz. Up on the up on the leaderboard there. Thank you, my friend. Yeah, all right, let's see. Uh, where are we at? Where are we at? 1504. All right, another dip back out of the zone. We'll see how many times we gotta come down here. We are back down here. Uh Kind of right here at structure. This is a zone. I want to give it a zone because it really is a zone. So anything up in here is going to be a nice spot to reverse out of. Uh, yeah, it's not going to be the worst thing. Okay, so we did close on that candle. Uh, the candle closed right at the top of the structure zone. So we are in blue right now on the new candle. Hopefully we get a rip here, guys. I feel like we're going to have some action for sure today. I don't know when it's going to happen, but I think we do rip here. All right, I think there's going to be an early morning dip, like I said. Maybe we have to stay down here a little bit longer. Maybe we come down a little further. But I think we're going to rip before lunch, all right? I think we're going to be up here above 1575 before lunch. That's what I think. That's what I think. Auntie M, hello. Good morning. Josh Griever says, let's see if I make a larger gains in the market after reading it. Oh, man, yeah, just uh, focus on that last kiss. That's going to help you out a lot uh, if you're trying to trade and, you know, get better at trading and learn these charts that uh that whole book was awesome and i learned a lot now a lot of it applies to forex you gotta remember that all right it applies to forex that whole entire book really but you can apply some of those strategies to the stock market as well if you're you know naked price action trading which is what i do and it's the way i'm able to call out stuff like this all right it's the way i'm able to uh the, the only reason i'm able to do that is from reading is really from reading that book and understanding price action on a fundamental level all right uh finding these zones these levels of structure uh, you know, by looking to the left, and you can see here, uh, this was pretty darn close, this dip. Six cents away from my line. Pretty close. All right, uh, 1513 on the ticker, making our way back up. Making our way back up. Oh, my God. Y'all see the latest Bosch on Reddit? Pretty convincing stuff. Yeah, no, uh, link it if you have it. I want to read it, or I can just go find it. I guess I could just go find it. Bosch, uh, MVIS, Reddit. Yeah, let's see. Uh, yeah, let's see what happens. This you talking about this? Yeah, you're talking about the Bosch connection. Yeah, I mean it makes sense. It does make sense. What can I say? Yeah, it definitely makes sense. Summit Sharma says, "I am happy to report that we have received our first wafers from our MEMS Fab partner." In fact, they are in the devices we are building now. I expect our Q4 initial sales units will will use dyes produced from our MEMS Fab partner. Beyond that, I think there's, I think there. I'm sorry, I can't even read right now. <laughs> I think there. See, but he he messed that up. All right. I think there's we're not commenting any more of that. I can't even read. Jesus Christ. I give up. We're gonna keep going on. Oh my God. <laughs> I need caffeine. All right. I'm just gonna scroll through this. Because clearly, I cannot read yet. It's too early for me to read. It has to be at least 9 a.m. for Trade Mode James to be able to read. And we still have uh, a few a few minutes left until 9. So clearly, that's why I can't read. Bosch teams with Microsoft develop software to find vehicle problems. Seamless integration between cars and cloud. Yeah, I mean, like I said, I, I think I did look through this the other day. Uh, yeah, it makes sense. I mean, it definitely makes sense. That's crazy. It's, it is pretty convincing. I will give Reddit that. They connect the freaking dots. I'll give them that. And I used to love I used to love Reddit MBIS. Too bad they screwed it up, and now I don't like them. I remember when Mavis had like eleven thousand members. Like if actually no, like eight thousand. I think they had eight thousand members when I when I first joined them. Now they have fifty or forty one million. Forty one thousand. God, I'm I'm on another level today, guys. I'm on another level today. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, it is pretty uh yeah, it's pretty pretty convincing. Yeah, when you really read through this and you look at all the all the all the dots being connected here. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff here. I'll link this in the chat for you guys. Let me figure out why it won't let me log in on Streamlabs. Sign into the chat. 
Yeah, all right, give me one second. I'll be right back. I got to do this. Don't leave. Yeah, there we go. There you go. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Matter of fact, let me do that on a full screen. Yes. All right, let's go. I feel better now. Yeah, I feel better. I feel better. Yeah, okay. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, we are up now. Let's go back. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's freaking go. Dang, man. Early morning dip and then the rip. Let's get it. I told you guys we'd be back up here before lunch. Let's go. 1565. Let's go, baby Mavis. She ain't a baby no mo. She ain't a baby no mo. I'm gonna stop saying baby Mavis. She's a woman now. This ain't no baby. She's a young lady. Yeah, she's a young lady now. Let's freaking do it. Nice, nice rip here. All the all the early morning crap is over. Currently, Mavis is trending like a, like crazy. Up 3% and climbing, guys. Up 3% and climbing, right? Yeah, it looks real good. Oh, my God. 1593. Let's go. <laughs> Let's freaking go. Let's get it. Yes. Oh, I got to draw them arrows. You're right. Dang. I forgot to do that. Here you go. Here's your arrow, my friend. Oh, man. Are we really going to hit uh, 1622 already? Man. Man, this is crazy. We're actually finally getting some movement here. Volume uh, for Microvision today is, so far, 1.64 million. So we're already almost at 2 million for the day uh, before 9 a.m. That's really good. That's really good. Yeah, that's real, 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 real good. Uh, big, big sells around sixteen dollars. All right, seventeen thousand shares being sold, sixteen bucks. A lot of people. Actually, there's not that much walls here. To be honest with you, that's the biggest one. Seventeen thousand shares at sixteen dollars. I understand you got paper hands, my friend. That's all right. Sell your shares to us. I'll be, I'll be more than happy to buy them. I mean, if I can. If not, I'm gonna leave it up to you guys. Yeah, all right. But we do have a big sell wall there. But that's all right. Uh, nice, nice rip here. Right out of structure, guys. Right out of structure. If you watched the Discord at all, I called for this. I told you guys we we're going to come down to structure, which is right here, right here. Look to the left. Where we, what did we do? We ripped right out of this. Didn't need anything else other than price action. That's it. Yeah, let's get it. Sweet Lady Mavis. That's that's what she's called now. Sweet Lady Mavis. That is That is the nickname. She's no longer a baby. Nick Cordova says Mavis is an evil witch. We love her. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah, she's done us dirty a few times. But it's all good. She's going to make it right in the end. I promise you that much. Yeah, I'm trying to see why this stays out. Yeah, give me one second. I cringe every time I see Gio's name on Reddit. I hate that guy, man. Yeah, he really he really is just... Yeah, no, that guy's no good. No good for the community. All right, uh, yeah, let's see. 1574 on the ticker. RSI probably headed towards the upside again. Yeah, nice little rip off right here. Nice, nice little rip. Right off 48 on the RSI. We got some room to run, guys. The one-hour time frame, Golden Cross... Hell, I mean, it, I guess technically it technically could happen today if we just rip stupid hard. But I think probably tomorrow or the next day is a little bit more likely, guys. These call-outs have been nasty. Look at this. I called out for this golden zone. I can't even believe how pinpoint accurate this has been. All right, bounced right off this golden zone. Came right down to structure and ripped back up. This is just... Man, Mavis is easily predictable. It really is. It's one of those stocks that, like, when it moves, it's easily predictable. But other than that, it's hard to predict when it's going to move. And that's the problem with it, right? It's hard to predict when these rips are going to happen. But it but it does happen. They 
it really loves to run when it runs and when it when it dips it loves to dip we already know that much yep we are following Russell 2000 and it's not great yeah matter of fact I want to check the deck what's the deck at today yeah what is the deck at up 0.61 percent nice we got some time we got some room to go up on the deck that's good that is good yeah no it's that's really good actually I feel like something's happening here pretty soon, guys. Like I said, you know, a couple weeks ago, maybe like even a month or two ago, it, we were talking about this. There's no way Savalas, Judy Karan, Summit Sharma, all these people joined a sinking ship. That did not happen. That is not even a thing. So when someone says this company's dead, or yeah, this company is not, they're going bankrupt, or they're, no, they're not. Look how much cash they have in the bank. Dumb, dumb. You're short in this stock right now, you're going to lose. You're going to lose, I promise you. If you're short my if you're short Mavis right now, you're going to lose. Is Carve taking off? Oh my god, please say yes. No. Oh, is it? It was down 3%. It's recovered a little bit. Yeah, we'll go to Carve real fast and check it out. Yeah, Carve, Carve, Carve. I'm still stuck on Carve, but yeah, hopefully we get above that 200 SMA and we get a golden cross on this one hour coming up. Yeah, let's go Carve. Let's go carve. Let's go carve. I need carve to recover. 1591, baby. Let's go. Get us over 1622 early. That would be awesome. If we get over 1622 and close, there's no way we're coming back down. If there was a time to get in, guys, it might be uh, coming up here like in the next two seconds. So I can't tell you when to get in, but, uh, you know, this wouldn't be a bad time if you were thinking about it. Yeah, it would not be a bad time to do it. James Jones says, just imagine the revenue from those HoloLens 2 military contracts. Yeah, that's going to be nice. Thumbs up in the chat. If you are currently invested in Microvision, how many of you here are for Microvision? I know we have 51 people in here. I'm not sure how many of you are here for MVIS, but that is my main holding. That is my largest holding, and I am uh, excited for this rip. 1604 on the ticker, allegedly. He's not lying. 1604. Down to 1601 now. Man, if we get above 16, 1622, guys, I'm telling you, this golden zone is coming. All right, this golden zone is coming. We're not that far away. 1840 is the bottom of this golden zone. So we're a little over $2. A little over, well, we're about $2.40 away. All right, so right now, as it stands, which is not that far, this thing could just do that today. We could be up by this golden zone by the end of lunch, to be honest with you. Uh, we'll have to see what happens. But I think, man, it's definitely in play. Look at this level. Look at this structure level to the left, guys. That's how I do this, all right? I zoomed out for you. We got touch points here. We got touch points here. We got touch points here. Right off that, actually. Here. Here. I mean, I could just do this all day at this level, guys. All right, this is a key level. 1622, if we break above that, the golden zone race is on. I don't know how long it's going to take. We could be there by the end of the day, to be honest with you. 1610, baby, let's go. <laughs> let's go, Mavis, man. Called all this stuff out. All this freaking stuff, all this big rip down here off the trend line, told you guys to break out of this descending wedge. It's on, and it did. We're on. I don't have to say it. You guys already know. Pinpoint accuracy. Let's get it. Yeah, let's freaking get it. Oh, my God. I'm patting myself on the back. I don't care. We got people in Mavis in here. Brian coming in with the Rockets. What's up, jo Jose T uh, Tamayo? Boston Ghost, what's up, man? Back in last week. You got it at the right spot, my friend. If you guys listen to me and follow me blindly, do not do that, but you're probably in the green. Oh, my God. Don't listen to me blindly, guys. Do not follow me blindly. I am not a financial advisor. I'm just a guy that trades stocks, but dang. You're probably killing it right now if you got in when I called this out down here. Touche. 1606 on the ticker. 1606 on the ticker. Nice rip today. Mavis currently up 4.11%. Uh, 4.2% for the day, actually. Yeah, LKC up 0.09%. Need some volume there. Uh, yeah, we definitely need some volume there. Now Carve's up. Carve's up 2%. Let's go, Carve. Yes, let's rip. Rip, rip, rip. 
Come on, Carve. Yeah, take us over that 200, baby. Take us over that 200. Let's get that Golden Cross on Carve. 1606 on the ticker for Mavis. And let's check AMC, I guess. AMC, AMC. Where are you at, AMC? Yeah, AMC currently sitting at 3347. Found some resistance real close to this 50 SMA. All right, so one hour time, time frame. We'll go down to the 15 real quick. There we go. So maybe a gold across on the 15. You see this pink line. Kind of, This kind of looks like a whale. Is that a coincidence? Is it a coincidence, guys? Have you ever seen the whale setup? Let me show this to you, guys. This is the whale setup right here. See if I can draw. Oh, my God. Did you ever see? This is technical analysis at its finest, guys. What you're, what you're witnessing right here is freaking magic. This is the whale setup. You see this? I can't make this stuff up. No, I'm kidding. I totally made this up. But either way, uh, this thing looks like it might rip here if it gets above that 200 SMA. <laughs> Yo, let's go. Neo seems to be moving too. Yeah, Neo's moving a little bit. Up 1.96%. It seems like all stocks are on the green uh, run for the day already. So, yeah, not too shabby. Not too shabby. A and Y is up another 12%. Jeez Louise. Is that a shark or a whale? I don't know. That's technical analysis. <laughs> All right. 1606 on the ticket for Mavis. Let's get above 1622. That's the goal. Man, Carve is ripping. Let's go, Carve. Get me unstuck, baby. Get me unstuck. I don't want to be stuck anymore. Finally, I'm under $1,000. Stuck on car, 981 bucks, down 41.8%. That was a terrible trade, but hey, I will hold the bag. I ain't selling for a thousand dollar loss. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Genog got bought out by DraftKings. Oh, did it really? Yeah. I feel like I was reading something about this. Yeah, oh my God, they did get bought out. Man, this thing ripped. 12 bucks to 18 open from $12 to an $18 open. Jeez. Yeah, that's uh that's crazy. It's up 51%. Yeah, I know. Holy crap. Microvision will close at $20 by the end of the day. Cutting trim. I hope you're right. Yeah, I hope you're right, my friend. Yes, I hope you're right. Guys, if you're just joining, hit that like button for me. All right. I really appreciate that. Uh, yeah, uh, definitely hit that subscribe button if you have not done that. All right. I'm not sure I'm liking Streamlabs. I'm going to go back to the old software, guys. I like I like the old one. Yeah, I don't know why. I just do. I like the old one a little bit more. We already got three thumbs down on the video. Nice. Can we get to 10 thumbs down? I'm gonna set a I'm gonna set a goal for myself. Let's get to 10 thumbs down. I'm joking. Don't do that. Yeah, don't do that. Man, this thing is ripping so hard. 1603 on the ticket for Mavis. Man, I need that caffeine. Or it made me a cup of coffee and I just couldn't do it. It hurt my stomach. So yeah, she went to get me a bang, which is probably even worse for my stomach, but at least it tastes good. <laughs> At least it tastes good, I guess. Yeah, uh, 1604 on the ticker for Mavis. Let's drop back down to a 15. This was a nice, nice rip. Nice dip right down to structure, guys. If you're in the Discord, you already know. I called for a dip to structure early this morning, and it happened right there. Boom. And now we recovered nicely. So if you bought the dip, good job. If not, you're probably still in, so you're still in the green. So that's a uh, good job on you. Yep, good job. 1602 on the ticker. 1622, this is the next really... Uh, key level we need to get above guys 1622 we get above that the golden zone is right above us oh my god like i mean like right above us and this is the golden zone off the big move all right this is the big golden zone not the little one this is the big boy big boy right here you see that golden zone off the big move off this big rip up here at 2470 all the way down to 1222 or 1218 a 50 percent retracement puts us back to 1840 all right, yeah, and then that puts us pretty close to 1932. If we get above that, then we close above the golden zone. I call for a new ATH, all right? I think we're going to hit over 28 bucks if we break this golden zone on this run. All right, I think it's just time. It's it's just time. All right, this is bullish as hell. I mean, I've never been more bullish on Microvision, so I think that if we break 
the golden zone and close uh, on a one hour or four hour time frame, yeah, you're likely going to see a new ATH. All right, FOMO is already kicking in. You see people buying this thing left and right on the Weeble uh, order book. So people are definitely buying the stock right now. All right, they just are. It's a 100% fat. Carve is running. Let's go. 1668. Let's go, Carve. Yeah. Let's go. Give me back. Give me unstuck, Carve. Let's go. Rip this thing. Yes. Could this be the squeeze? Could this thing squeeze off this? That'd be awesome. That would be amazing. Oh my god. 28 by the end of the week. I don't know about that. I don't know about that, my friend. Maybe I hope. Maybe I hope. Sandra loaded up another hundred shares on the dip. Nice, Sandra. You're gonna be happy with that in the next month or two. Yeah, I'm pretty sure about it. Alright, 1610 on the ticker. Yeah, let's go, Mavis. Give me one sec, guys. Got to make a quick phone call. My bad. I got to call the realtor. Give me one second. Give me one sec, guys. I'm almost done here. My bad. I'm almost done. 30 seconds. All right, guys, I'm back. Sorry about that. My apologies. Oh, my God, Sandra. Sandra Lay coming in with a $50 super chat. Sandra, thank you so much. Says, Nick, the ball is in your court. <laughs> Sandra, thank you. Much appreciated. Thank you so much. All right, uh, 15 or 1601 on the ticker for Mavis. Carve, 1655. Nice little rip on Carve. Hopefully, we can get up above 1750 on Carve. That's kind of where I had this line drawn in. So, 1750 close would probably... Be real, real, real good for us. Have a good move here. Ooh, G-Nog is moving. Man, this thing really ripped. Shout out if you're in G-Nog and you're making money. I, I missed this one. It's crazy how these things just happen, guys, and this is what I'm talking about. DraftKings bought G-Nog. Okay, look how much it jumped. Now imagine if Mavis gets some news. It's going to go even further than that. I'm almost, I'm almost positive about it. Almost positive. Anyways, what was I talking about before? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
All right, so four hour time frame above the 200 SMA. Guys, this thing is priming itself, I'm telling you. Uh, we close above the 200 on the four hour time frame. We're about to get a golden cross on the four hour time frame. All right, this is going to start doing this, and we're going to get that cross at some point. That's going to take us up. I'm telling you guys, if we close above this golden zone, new ATH. I'm just, I'm letting you guys know. All right, I can see the code, man. I can see the code. The code of the, the code of the system. I can see it. It's like, I don't know if it's magic or what. But I can see through the code. We break above this golden zone and close. It's a new ATH. Mark my words. Mark my words. That is not a beer you just heard. I promise. It's not one of those days yet. All right, guys. Yeah, all right, guys. Uh, six fifteen ninety on the ticker. A little bit of a dip here. Uh, nothing crazy. Yeah, nothing crazy. But we might see a little bit of resistance here off sixteen twenty two. Look how far up we ran. We went all the way up here to sixteen nineteen. I didn't even see it. I didn't catch it because I was talking. Uh, here we go. So it went up to sixteen nineteen. Pretty close. Found resistance right here. We're gonna have the same kind of thing going on up here that we did at fourteen eighty five. All right, you see this down here at 1485, probably have the same thing happen right here at 1622. These are key levels. All right, they're hard to get through, but when you do, we we go. So hopefully we can get above 1622. Yeah, that's the goal. That is the goal. Nick Cordova, where you at, Nick? Yeah, fresh powder. Rick, Rick Dodson, what's up, man? Yeah, what's going on, buddy? William Side says, hey, thanks, hey, thanks, bro, for teaching me a little bit of technical analysis. I use that for butterfly stock ticker to, to butterfly stock ticker be FLY. I got in at 1021. Yeah, I think I looked at that stock the other day for somebody. But shout out to you, man. Make some money in there, brother. Yeah, shout out to you. Sandra says, nice to see all green. Let's check MMAT for Sandra. That's one of her faves. Yeah, let's check it out. MMAT. Yeah, MAT. All right, 341 on the ticker. Need to get above structure. All right, structure is going to be somewhere. Yeah, like right here, kind of. Kind of a zone here on, on this one. So a zone like this looks about right. So we're going to need to get above really like 375, something like that, to really get some rips going on. But you are likely going to have a golden cross here on the one hour at some point. You see the 50 below price and the 200 above price. We need that cross to happen so we can, uh, yeah, so we can go ahead and do that. And get MMAT back to where it needs to be. 1604 on the ticker. Nice down to down to 1595 now. 1622. We're not gonna call much out until that happens. We gotta get above 1622. That's like the key. Yeah, that's the key. Almost four million uh, volume in Mavis. Heck yeah. Yeah, we're definitely ripping off. Yeah, let me see here. Yeah. All right, guys, if you want to get on the Discord, which I have spiffed up, uh, the public chat's free. I'm going to add some stuff in the public chat, so feel free to use that without any pledge or anything. All right, if you want to get in the members area where everyone's at, that is a $50 one-time pledge. That gives you lifetime access. All right, so send me a DM on Discord if you want to join our team, our trading team, our trading community, and we'd love to have you. All right, the, the link for that is discord.io slash trade mode James. That is going to take you right to the Discord community. If that's something you want to do, send me a DM. Uh, discord.io slash trade mode James. That is the link, all right? Yeah, to the Discord. Type that in your browser. It'll take you right there. Yeah, okay, and uh, appreciate that, Sandra. Thank you. 
A and Y is definitely moving. I see it. I see A and Y ripping here too. Yeah, that's crazy. As soon as I get out, as soon as I get out of A and Y, this thing rips. That is so irritating. Man, I swear that's so irritating. And I'm the best at that. I'm the best at getting out right before. Yeah, that is the best. Alex says, Sandra, you recover your accounts after all the nonsense. Uh, she did. I'll let her answer for you. Answer, but she did. Yeah, she's fine. She got all of that back. And uh, yeah, I'm happy about that. Earnings tomorrow on MMAT. Nice. Yeah, hopefully it gets, it gets some volume and some movement, Sandra. I hope it does. Let's see here. Yeah, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. 81 people in here, guys. If you hit that like button for me, I would really appreciate that. We're in here just following the action, all right? Following the action. Yeah, let's check AMC again real quick. AMC. All right. Resistance here at this 50 SMA around 34.47. We're going to need to get above that. RSI on the one hour time frame is looking uh, good, actually. Yeah, there's some room to move. So, yeah, if we get above the 50 and then get above the 200, might get a golden cross, potentially. Yeah, and that could cause a catalyst for a, a higher share price. But, like I said, there's, I mean, we just seem kind of stagnant down here. So, we did come down exactly to where I said here, too. Uh, I called for this dip down to about $29. I think we come down to 20 still. I don't know. Uh... I think maybe, if, I mean, if we break this zone, I can't say we're going to do it, but if we break this zone I had drawn in, this is the golden zone. I don't know why it's green. Yeah, this is a golden zone. But if we break this golden zone and start closing below, $20 is definitely in play for AMC, guys. There's no structure up in here, and there's nothing really to stop us from coming down. This whole up, all up in here. So, yeah, we're definitely probably coming down to 20 if we close below the golden zone. All right, 1593 on the ticker for Mavis. Let me chug some of this bang. Yeah, let's check Palantir. Yeah, Palantir is one of my first stocks I ever invested in. I'm glad I got out because this thing... Oh, man. Yeah, this thing could go back to 40 bucks real easily. Yeah, I mean, right now it's at a key level, guys. If Palantir breaks uh, where it's... I mean, it looks like it's going to rip. This looks insanely bullish. Just looking at this. Yeah, this stock, this chart. I'm going to go up to a four hour real quick. Yeah, this thing looks insanely bullish. We have a verified uptrend already on the four hour time frame for Palantir. This would be a nice swing trade. All right, we already have three touch points. One, two, three, not even including the beginning. Guys, this thing is about to freaking rip. If I, get to, if I get the dry powder uh, coming through in the next couple days, like I think, I might just ride this for a swing. Uh, I think Palantir rips here. It's already broken this super key level on the top side. And also, we have our verified uptrend from this uh, on this four-hour time frame. Looking super duper bullish on Palantir. Oh, my God. And it didn't move really for a long time. Really, we just kind of had a downswing here since, uh, you know, really forever. It's just kind of been consolidating. But this was a nice rip off 17 bucks. I didn't even realize it got this low. I have not checked this stock in a long time. I did not realize that it came all the way down to $17. Holy crap. I'm glad I pulled out, guys. I made a I made a profit over here in January on Palantir. I got in like right here around $30. So I got in right here at the break of this uh, key zone right here, like literally at 30 bucks. I think I got in at like $30.20. So I got in like right above this key level and I wrote it up here and took a profit. So... I'm glad I got out because I actually had like 20 grand in this. So I had like 20K invested and took it up here and got out right at this reversal signal. You see this big reversal signal here. Uh, this candle right here. This I got out right here. So, oof. Yeah, that's crazy. I did not realize it got all the way to $17. Man. Anyways, it looks like it's primed to rip, guys. Four hour time frame on Palantir. Golden Cross coming up. Breaking key levels. Verified uptrend. Looks really good. It looks super solid. And that's a good long-term investment, guys. I'm talking like 5, 10 years. You put some money in Palantir, you're going to be a happy, happy person in like 5 years. If you have the, the powder to hold, you know? All right, Mavis currently at 1591, trying to get back up over 1622. Uh, found some resistance here. Found resistance right at 1622, right there. Yeah, so we're going to need to get above that to really to really start moving here. Yeah, American Dream, thank you for sharing my video. I appreciate you. Yeah, thank you so much. Everything's in the green today, guys. DD's in the green, up 1.7%. MMAT up 2%. Uh, up 2 LKCO is down 1.05%. Damn you, LKCO. 
but it's all good because I'm not worried about the short term on LKCO. That is a long term hold for me. So whatever happens, happens the short term. I don't really care. I'm just going to watch it rip one day and then we're going to be happy. Me and Rick Dotson are going to be on the yacht. Rick Dotson, where you at? We're going to be on the yacht, Rick Dotson. Can you guys hear the music? Yeah, is that too loud? How's the music sound behind me? Does it sound all right? Do I sound do I sound sexy? Do I sound all What's the word I'm looking for? Hey, what's the word I'm looking for? Like what's a word for sexy but not so abrasive? Suave? <laughs> Smooth? <laughs> yeah, suave. Yeah, all right. Come on, baby. Get back up. 1588 on the ticker. Yeah, 1588 on the ticker. Good morning, everybody. <laughs> oh, my God. That was not my cat, just so you know. That was not my cat. That was an actual human being. Yeah, right. Uh, nice little recovery here. What are we at? 15, 16 dollars on the dot. Let's go. 16 dollars on the dot. Let's go. Sandra again. Thank you for that the super chat, Sandra. And who else gave me a super chat? Yeah, thank you as well. Yeah, I think that was Charles Chiz. Yes, thank you guys so much. Yeah, radio voice, radio voice. Let's get it. Sixteen dollars on the dot. AMC thirty three seventy eight. Let's go. AMC is up three point two percent. CTXR is up zero point two seven percent. Guys, I am convinced CTXR is going to rip. Right? There is no doubt in my mind. All right, CTXR will get FDA approval. I'm convinced. I did a lot of reading last night on CTXR. I'm convinced the Mino Lock will be revolutionary in their niche. Right, and that is huge. CTXR is headed towards the moon. We just need a catalyst, all right? As soon as they announce FDA approval, it's on. That's all we're waiting for with CTXR. So if you're in CTXR and you're stuck, don't worry about it because I'm telling you right now, they're going to get FDA approval. I guarantee it. I don't guarantee it 100%. I'm going to say 99%, all right? I'm going to leave some variants, but I'm pretty certain about it, guys. I don't think they're not going to get it. I think they will get it. And once they do, you already know if you know anything about the stock market or any pharmaceutical stocks at all anything about them they rip when they get fda approval and i mean just rip just rip they rip so hard babe they said you have a sexy voice you have a radio voice <laughs> yeah oh my god yeah ctxr is going down i can't wait man stuck a little bit on it i mean a little bit more than a little i'm stuck like 3100 bucks on it but i'll tell you what i don't regret getting in I regret getting in when I did. I don't regret getting in. This is going to be a moon. This is going to be a moon stock. Give it give it 6 to 12 months. It's going to be a moon stock. All right? Mark my freaking words. Mark my freaking words. I'm not a financial advisor, so don't follow me blindly. All right? Do not follow me blindly, but I'm pretty certain that uh, CTXR is going to be a winner. Yep. Uh, Josh Creepy says, very happy to be in CTXR. Thanks to James. Never risk anything I care to lose, but I want gains. And just so you know, John, if you're listening, Josh did not follow me blindly. Josh did not follow me blindly. None, none of these people follow me blindly. They don't do that. They don't do that, and it's not my fault if anybody loses money. I am not a financial advisor. Please read the text on the screen. Not a financial advisor. Yeah, they're both going to rip. What's up, Critic13? What's up, my friend? Yeah, let's go. Come on, Mavis. Yeah, we're having a little dip here. Nice rip. All the way up to about 1620. So, so close to closing above that 1622. Now we're having a little rip, I mean, a little dip, and it's okay. That's all right. I'm not worried about it. We have had a really nice run out of this descending wedge. How many of you know about the descending wedge uh, after watching this channel? And if you do know about it, did you know about it before I started telling you about it? Because these patterns on Mavis play out for our in our favor every single time. I mean, I could go back and draw all these in. I'm telling you, they play out in our favor every single freaking time when they come down to this demand zone. They just do. We didn't even have to come down to 10 bucks. We came down to 12. What is this? 12. Was it 1218? Yeah, I think it was 1218. 1215. 1215, a rip off 1215. All right, it's still in the demand zone. If I go to the left, you'll see it. 
there's just been rips off this area left and right. Some variants in here, right, came down a little lower. This one came down a little lower, but still have some action around this area. This was a key level. Uh, and like I said, not that hard to predict movements on Mavis. She loves to follow structure, and it's very obvious to me uh, when this is going to rip and when it's, you know, where it's going to fall to. Uh, same thing with this call out. Fall right here down to structure. If you saw the Discord, called this out. Fall to structure, then a rip. Told you guys, don't buy early morning on Monday. Do not buy early morning on Monday. If you want to add on, wait for the early morning rip that's going to happen, and it did. Now here we are at 16.01, so let's freaking get it. Neo's up 2%. Let's go. Josh Griever says, James never tells us to buy or sell. He just has great entertainment, I think. Thank you, brother. No, I will never tell you to buy or sell. You will never see me ever, ever do that, ever. Not in a million years. Yeah, uh, let's see here. Sherry Baker says, hello, can you do a quick TA on EVGO? Yep, let's look at it. Yeah, let's look at it, Sherry. EVGO. Same story. Same story, different ticker, right? Yeah, same thing. Big dip out of this wedge. Uh, I'm not going to go too into depth here. But, yeah, we can see that the reversal has happened. Wow, this thing really, really, really dipped, too. This looks like looks like Famy a little bit. Yeah, this looks like Famy just a little bit. Either way, 15-minute uh, time frame. About to get a golden cross, uh, Sherry Baker, on the 15-minute time frame. Likely bring you up to structure, which would be somewhere up in uh, the $11, $11 range. Looks like. Looks like maybe like 1080 to 11 bucks yeah you might get a might get a rip up the structure somewhere up in here all right yeah that's the way it's looking if i do a fibonacci retracement on this you're gonna see that the golden zone is about the same same level and it, like i said guys i don't really need to use the fib because i can already see through the code all right but if you want to use the fib that's the way you do it practice using your fib this is going to be about what i just said all right Ex pretty pretty close to it yeah, right. a little bit lower. It's got a little bit lower of a zone than I had, but I still think it's going to go up to about $11 just from looking at it. Uh, yeah, but this is the golden zone, so it's getting close. A close above this 200 Sherry Baker would probably guarantee you a golden zone touch. And if you close above the golden zone, like I said, you start closing above reversal zones. That's where the power lies. All right. So this is a reversal zone. Don't you know, don't get it twisted. These golden zones are reversal zones. So a break then coming back up to it. Typically, it likes to reverse at these zones. All right. But when you start closing above them, that's when you get that's when you get power. That's when you see strength. All right. So looking good for the short term on uh, EVGO, Sherry. It looks good. RSI. Check it real quick for you. RSI on the one hour has some room to run. All right. So, yeah, definitely think you're going to see a, a, a spike up to about $11 at least. Uh, at least it looks like it at least. Uh, if you're in the stock, good luck. 1607 on the ticker for Mavis. Come on, sweet lady Mavis. I'm not calling her a baby no more. She ain't a baby no more. She ain't a baby no more. Joe McGowan says, I follow you with my glasses on, not blindly. <laughs> touche. Yeah, touche, my friend. <laughs> yeah, right. Uh, let's see here. Can you guys hear the music? Give me a thumbs up in the chat if you can hear the music behind my voice. I want to make sure it's not too loud and not too soft. Yeah, so we're just chilling. I got a random, it's like a random YouTube playlist, royalty free. Mavis is the only thing saving my portfolio today. Yeah, Mavis is ripping, guys. Mavis is freaking ripping lately. Let's go. 1613 on the ticker. A nice recovery off of this second dip here. All right. Nice looking candle on the one hour time frame. Just super duper bullish. Never been more bullish on Mavis ever. Like, I promise you. I Yeah, I really haven't. I've never, ever, ever been more uh, bullish on Mavis. Yeah, it's just a fact. It's just a fact. Yeah, give me a second here. Let me, uh, yeah, let me do something real quick. Yeah, let me do something real quick. Limit. Yeah, give me a second here. Yeah, let's see if that works. Yeah, let's see if that works. All right. Yeah, let's see. AMC 3394. Uh, Mavis 1596.
All right, guys, I'm back. Yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah, I'm here. Carve up. What? Cars up 18%? No, don't play with me. Don't play with me. Don't play with me. Oh my God. Let's go, Carve. Yes. Thank God. Thank God I didn't have, I didn't have to wait that long. <laughs> Yes, Carve! Let's go, Carve! Let's get some rockets in the chat for Carve. Trade mode James getting unstuck. Let's go. Let's freaking get it. 1801 on the ticker for Carve. Above structure, above the 200, above the 50. About to get a golden cross on Carve. Oh my god. Thank the Lord above. Let's go, Carve. Rockets in the chat for Carve. I know a lot of you aren't in Carve, but I'm in Carve and I was stuck. So now I'm getting unstuck. Only down $780 now. I will take that. I will take that all freaking day. I will take that. Let's go. Sandra wasn't lying. Carve is up, baby. Let's go. 16.91%. Man. A and Y is up 13%. Everything is green. I knew it was just a matter of time. The market had been red for way too long, guys. It can't stay red forever. This is like a perfect example. If you're in the stock market, if you're new to the stock market, you're new to trading, understand that it cannot stay red forever. It just can't. It cannot stay red forever. All right, so if you're stuck holding the bag, and you're in a good stock and you have conviction enough to put money in just know it can't stay red forever at some point it's going to go up stocks go up that's what they do they retrace and they go up if you're in a profitable company uh yeah you're in a company that has potential and you had conviction like i said just don't sell i mean just hold your position yeah you know what i mean lkco says otherwise wait for the lkco rip uh rip rick dotson yeah just wait my friend wait until wait until this thing rips people are going to be People are going to be going crazy trying to get an LKCO when this thing rips. Just a little bit of news is going to just take this thing to the next freaking level. Mark my words. We're good, Rick Dotson. Yeah, okay. Uh, Mavis, 1602 on the ticker. Close. Oh, here we go. Six, as soon as the dubstep, as soon as the dubstep hit, this thing ripped. 1614. Yeah, let's go, baby. 1616, actually. 1805 for Carve. Yeah, let's go. I'm having a good day. Let's get it. Yeah, let's get it. Let's get it. Sandra has a thousand shares of LKCO. Let's go, Sandra. We're all going to be on the yacht sipping pink champagne. I promise you. Yeah, we'll just have to wait. We're all going to be chilling. It's a matter of time, guys. It's a matter of time. Hey, if the music's too loud, let me know. It might be a little loud. Uh, John Pryor says, I've been in it for a while. I've been in it for a whole... I think even been a while. Worked my average from 360 to 294. So this is awesome to see. Finally, that's what's up. Nick will be with us too, of course. How can we ever leave Nick Cordova out of the yacht party? That's like blasphemy. Yeah, we can never leave Nick out of the freaking yacht party. How many of you are coming to Vegas when, when Mavis pops off? I promise you, we're having a party in Vegas. Drinks on me. If you got that joke, you've been to Vegas. If not, you've never been to Vegas. Drinks on me in Vegas, guys, all right? Uh, we're having a party out there for sure. I'm just gonna, we're just gonna have a party out there. You're gonna have to make it. Because once Mavis pops off, we're just, we're going to go crazy out there. I hope you all actually go, because I'm not even joking about this. I really plan to have the team go to Vegas. <laughs> like, I, I really hope we all go out there. It'd be so fun. I'm not playing. Yeah, that would be super duper fun. Go eat some awesome badass food. Have a few drinks. Play some slots. Watch Trade Mo James lose a couple thousand in roulette. Maybe more. <laughs> If you saw me in the casino chat, uh, casino channel, you already know how I get down. You already know. Where's Joseph Yoon? I know how Joseph Yoon gets down. Some gambling maniacs in this team. Let's get it. All right. Little uh, resistance here again. Once again, guys, like I said, it's going to be no different than 1485, right? It's just not. There's not going to be a difference here. 1485, we had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven seven touch points on 1485 before a dip and then a rip so like i said this 1622 is going to be rough it's going to be rough nobody ever said it's going to be easy all right we could just come back down to the structure again the 50 sma we could just come right back down to 1485 right now who knows but uh this is going to give us some trouble i can already tell all right we are having a little bit of resistance off this 1622 or a lot of resistance i should say yeah 1816 on carve let's go carve please be the squeeze car be the squeeze Man, if this thing rips, that'd be so awesome. I'd be a happy guy. Yeah, just let us know, please. I will. I will. I'm not playing. We're totally going. 
Alan and Kimberly Anderson say, what would you buy with dry powder right now, or is it too late for anything? I can't tell you that legally, especially if my lawyer is listening, which he may, we, he very well may be. Uh, he very well may be, so I can't tell you that. But I'll tell you this, everything's looking good, and uh, some of my holdings that I have, my biggest holdings are good. So Mavis, uh, it would not be a bad time to, you know, if you wanted to do Mavis, it's not a bad time. At this point, I'd wait for a dip, but I can't tell you when to get it. Hey, get down. Hey, Psst. Sorry, cat's going crazy. Uh, I can't tell you when to get in, right? But I can't tell you what to buy. But Mavis is looking pretty good, all right? A dip back down to structure here would be a decent little spot. Maybe if it came back down to 1572, it might be a good time to get in. Uh, you know, but it's anything under 16 bucks is going to be a good average. All right, anything under $16 on Mavis is a good average. All right, that's just a fact. Now, a dip might happen. We might go back down to $10. Who knows? But either way, at the end of it, when it's all said and done, $16 is going to be a steal for Microvision, all right? I just, I'm just convinced, so. Uh, but no, it's not too late. Yeah, it's not too late. 1895 carve? Oh my god, Cause it, could this be the squeeze? Yo, I need to check, the, I need to check Fintel. This could be the squeeze, guys. Carve did over 100% retracement. Look at this. Carve did a huge retracement. Not 100%, actually, but a lot. I need to check Fintel. Please, God, tell me there's 10 million available. 10 million, come on. All right, 50,000. <laughs> I was way off. <laughs> We're just a little off 10,000, guys. All right, 50,000 available. This thing's being shorted to crap right now. 1880 on the ticker. RSI probably getting oversold. I mean, overbought. Yep, overbought here on Carve. Uh, let me see real fast. Car volume for the day, 619,000. We don't even have a million in volume. Can you imagine if people actually started jumping in this? Yeah, this is going to pop off. That's going to pop off. My arrow. Okay. Don't let me forget. Boom. Technical analysis. Chapter one, draw an arrow. All right. If you want to, if you want your stock to go up, that's all you got to do. Yeah, that's it. That's all you got to do. Don't worry about anything else. Learn to draw an arrow. That is what you need to learn to do, guys. All right. Technical analysis. I have some weird sarcasm. I apologize. We need some fan art of James and his cats. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta show you all these cats at some point. They are just, oh my god, you guys would think Dinah is beautiful. Matter of fact, let me get a picture of Dinah real quick for you. I'm gonna snap a picture and put it in the Discord. Dinah. Hey, look at me. Dinah, Dinah. She doesn't want to look at me. I'm trying to get a picture for you guys. I'm gonna go get a picture. I'll be right back. I feel like I gotta get a picture. Hold on. Yeah, I'm back. I'm back. I tried to get a picture. But she's pissed off at something. I don't know. I think she's mad at Roman. <laughs> I think she's mad at Roman. Yeah, but if you want to see Dinah, look on the Discord right now. I'm going to post a picture. Yeah, it's not the best picture. Yeah, but it is a picture. All right, members chat. There's Dinah. She looks mad. She looks pissed off. I think she's mad at Roman. Roman chases her around and stuff. So, yeah, I'm not really sure why she's so mad, but she's mad. You can see it in her eyes. She's just super pissed. <laughs> she is an antisocial cat. Yeah, she likes to be alone. Sometimes she plays with them, but she likes to just chill by herself, you know? 1844 on Carve, probably having a sell-off here, imagine. Uh, we ran all the way to 1840, or I'm sorry, ninth, wow, 1915 on Carve. Let's go. This is going to recover, I hope. We're about to get a golden cross here. We are about to get a golden cross here. Oh my gosh, I hope this rips. 1580 for Microvision. Yeah, let's go. Auntie M says, I'll definitely meet you all in Las Vegas. Let's go. Rockets in the chat if you actually will go to Vegas with us. If you actually will go to Vegas, let's see some rockets in the chat. How big is this party going to be? She looks mad. Yeah, Roman was just messing with her. 
Yeah, she looks super pissed. That's what I tell, that's what I tell you guys. She looks she looks a little angry. <laughs> yeah, she looks a little bit angry. <laughs> yeah, she that picture does not do her justice. She is a freaking beautiful cat. I forgot what kind of cat she is. Um, oh, I forgot the name, but they're like notorious for having like attitudes, and she definitely has an attitude. She is, uh, yeah. JC's going to Vegas. Steve's going to Vegas. Sandra, obviously. Dax Dog Ranch. Y'all better not be playing because we're definitely doing it. We're definitely doing it. Wait till Mavis pops off. It's going down. Carve short interest 50,000. Things being shorted to crap right now. Microvision sitting at 250,000 on Fintel. Let's go. Institutional ownership is going up every day for Mavis, guys. All right, a bunch of 13Fs filed here in the last couple days. On the 9th, we had a bunch of people buying stocks. Uh, IMC Chicago bought 77,000 shares. Uh, before that, Mitsubishi bought 292,000. Is Mits is this have to do with Japan? I don't know. Let's see. Where's Mitsubishi? Yeah, is this going to Google? I feel like Mitsubishi is in Japan. Mitsubishi. Yeah, I feel like it's... Yeah, I feel like it's Japan. It is. All right, so guys, uh, Summit was talking about Japan a lot in that earnings call, right? And uh, Mitsubishi just, if you guys didn't know this, they just bought or re-added onto their position uh, 292,583 shares at a 1765 average. All right, so that's, they're in Japan. So I don't know, you know, connect the dots if you want. I'm just saying, yeah, there's a lot of good things going for Mavis. Actually, no, I need to find out the name. Now I'm going to call Ori and ask because I forgot what the name of the cat is. Yeah, let me let me, let me me call Ori and ask. You guys can hear this. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Hello? Hey, what what kind of cat is uh, Dinah? I forgot. What kind of what's cat her, is Dinah? Yeah, what's her breed? A tortoise shell. Tortoise shell? Yeah. Okay. All right. That's all I needed. Okay. All right. Love you. Bye. Let me see. Be careful. I will, I am. All right, bye. Yeah, tort tortoise shell. Tortoise shell. They're like black and gold usually. Is it tortoise? Yeah, okay. I guess that's how you spell it. She's one of these. She's one of these guys. Yeah, she's one of these cats, all right? Yeah, she kind of looks like this. See, that kind of looks like her. They. This looks exactly like her, actually. She has. She literally looks just like this. So she's a beautiful freaking cat. And she definitely holds up to the attitude. These cats are, like, notorious for having, like, bad attitudes. She really does. But she's... I freaking love this cat, man. She's awesome. Yeah, she has a crazy attitude. Like, I'm not even playing. Like, I've never seen a cat with so much, like, personality slash bad attitude. She just hates the world. But she likes to love. She likes to love, too, so... Uh, yeah, let's see here. Let's check Discord real fast. Yeah, let's do this real quick. Let me see the uh, volumes real fast for the stocks. Looking good for the day, guys. Yeah, we had a lot of volume going to the market. All right, Carve has almost a million in a million in volume. Microvision currently has five million before ten a.m. Let's go. That's what's up. Big buy walls here at fifteen ninety six, guys. Big buy walls, hundreds of shares, couple for a thousand, a lot more buys than sells right now. You'd be crazy to short this stock. What are you doing with your life? If you short Microvision right now, you're you're crazy. I mean, do what you want. I can't tell you what to do. If you think it's gonna fall, then hey, do your thing. But I think you're gonna lose. I think you start trading against the big money, you're gonna lose. And the banks have decided that this is the time they wanted to move, which they do every time off this area. So hey, I'm not gonna trade against the banks. I'm not trading against the banks. You won't see me doing that often. I just, just not the way I trade. John Pryor says, do my cat hates everything unless they want it. Yeah, right? It's, it's, cats are weird animals. Like, we have four cats. They're, they're so weird. I can't even, like, sometimes I just sit here and watch them. They are so freaking weird. Like, I'd never seen anything like it. They're weird cats. I mean, I've seen some weird cats. These, these cats are, they have their own little universe in here. Like, we're living in their world basically like they don't give a shit about us they want what they want it could be four in the morning 
If they're hungry, they're gonna beat down the door. I'm not playing. We have to lock them up sometimes. They're so crazy. All right, 1801 on carve. Nice, nice little uh, rip here, and then a dip back down to structure. Standard. So 1801, we need this thing to just take off. It would be real nice to get this golden cross happening with carve. Josh Screever says, "I have kids. I don't want any animals, and kids don't take care of their pet. Their pets' parents do." Yeah, that's true. I'd rather have kids than cats at this point. <laughs> Yeah, no, we're living in their world, I promise you. Dogs are a different story. These cats, they don't care, man. They don't care about you or me or anything else. They do what the hell they want to do. I'm in their world. I already know that. They've already they've already proven that to me. This squirt bottle used to be effective when they were little. When they were younger, the squirt bottle was effective. I need a freaking real... I need a shotgun now to make them do anything. Like a, an actual gun that shoots bullets. Anything else they don't care about. I can squirt them in the face. They don't care. They just keep doing it. It's crazy. It's like they're immune to my to my discipline now. It's like so irritating. They scratch on the walls and all this other stuff. So yeah, don't get four cats. Highly recommend. Do not do that. <laughs> yeah, these Sandra has some cool pets. Sandra has a really badass German Shepherd. If you want to see it, Sandra maybe posted uh, an image in the Discord. If you want, Sandra has a really really cool German Shepherd. All right. Yeah, a little dip here. All right, 1590 on the ticker for Mavis. Carve having a little dip as well. That's okay. These retracements are healthy, all right? They are healthy. If we do a golden zone off this little move right here, it's going to take us back down to structure. You see this, all right? Back 50% on this little move would take us to about 1555. I'm not saying that's going to happen. This is a 15-minute time frame, so sometimes these golden zones are a little iffy on the lower time frames. But still, you see, it's still pretty much at structure here, right? The golden zone right up in here, right at structure. Yeah, so we'll see what happens. We shall see what happens. What you need is a super soaker. Yeah, no, for sure. I don't even know if that would work at this point. They don't care about water. They don't care. So should we also invest in Chewy? <laughs> Man, Chewy ripped. Yeah, I remember seeing Chewy back in the day. Yeah, this thing. What did it? What did this go from? What is? What is Chewy's? Yeah, is it that? Yeah. This thing friggin' ripped. Look at this. Since IPO, just steady, steady movement. In fact, this could probably go up. I don't know. Yeah, Chewy's a pretty big company. What's Chewy's market cap? Yeah, what is Chewy's market cap? Chewy market cap. Yeah, 37 billion. Are you freaking kidding me? Oh my god. I did not know their market cap was that high. That's crazy. Yeah, that is crazy. Chewy was acquired by PetSmart for $3.35 billion. Yeah, wow, which was the largest acquisition of an e-commerce business at the time. Yeah, that is crazy. $36 billion market cap? That's insane. Yeah, if Chewy can do it, Microvision can definitely do it. If Chewy can do it, Mavis can do it. Yeah, a stun gun. <laughs> the freaking stun gun. God, I don't want to kill him. I guess a stun gun's better than a shotgun. Guys, if you're just joining the, the stream right now, hit that like button for me. I would really appreciate it. We're just hanging out, talking about these stocks, seeing what's going on, uh, watching these things rip and dip. All right, Carve. I'm going to watch Carve today because it's on a move. Yeah, it's on a move. 1827 on Carve. Let's go. Let's go, Carve. That's what I like to see. Yes, yes, yes. Let's get a golden cross on the 30. That would be what I'm looking for here. Golden cross on the 30 about to happen. And it's, guys, when you see these SMAs, all right, you see these golden crosses, you know the ones that are actually going to rip because when the cross happens, if both if both of these are going up on the cross like this, all right, you see how these are both going towards the upside? Thumbs up in the chat. Now, if the 200 is going down a little bit, like if the 200 was coming down this way, instead of going up with the 50, I would say maybe it doesn't work. But when you get both SMAs curving to the top and you get a golden cross, that setup is very bullish, all right? Thumbs up in the chat if you hear what I'm saying. All right, now if it did something like this, all right, and this is just kind of basic, but I mean, it, it really does work. I've seen it play out like this. If the 200 is doing this, coming down, and the 50 goes up, yeah, you can still get some movement, all right? But it's a lot better when both are facing the top side. It just, it always moves a lot more when it's like that, I promise you. Yeah, all right, it just does. Yeah, better than a shotgun. <laughs> we chewy to get our pets, our pets' toys and food. We don't even go to the store anymore. I know. Yeah, we just 
My uh, girlfriend uses Chewy as well, so she gets dog food through Chewy. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken. 1851 for Carve. Let's go. Let's get back to 19. 1593 for Mavis. Guy is stuck here at uh, right around structure, all right? Like I said, same thing here, same thing here. These key levels, guys, they matter, all right? They do matter. And I'm going to put this zone in here because like, I like to use zones more than lines. There's the zone, all right? Yeah, we need to get above 1622. That's the key. That is the key to the golden zone. You guys want the key to the golden zone? It's 1622. Yeah, we get above 1622, it's on. I promise. I promise. I promise. It's good. It's real good. It's going to be good. You ever put two-sided tape on Cat's Paw? You will die laughing. Two-sided tape. No, I've never done that. I kind of want to troll them now and do that, though, for sure. They troll us all day long. I mean, just constantly. Yeah, and they do it on purpose. They know. They know what they're doing. I'm convinced. I am convinced cats can understand English or any language. They just don't talk. They just look at you and judge you. And yeah, you know, they just judge you. They just sit there and hear what you're saying and they just don't respond because they just don't care. But they just sit there and judge you. I'm convinced. I know they know what I'm saying when I'm talking. All right, Carve, having a little dip here. 1789 might fall back to structure here, probably will. And then maybe we see a little rip. I don't know. Hopefully it happens. Ethereum is up. Let's go. Guys, Ethereum, if, I, if you follow my Ethereum call out, uh, I wish I had some more dry powder for this, but I don't. Uh, we broke 30, We broke 3,000, all right? This, we're, he we're headed for a new ATH. I, I just, I can feel it on Ethereum. It's headed for a new ATH. Oh, you even see the arrow here. So you know it's not, you know it's serious when there's already an arrow on the screen. All right, there's already an arrow here. What else more do you need? Who's with me? Yo, who's with me in this chat? I know we got 90 people in here. We ain't got no comments. What's going on? I know you're having a green day. Most of you are in the green for today for sure. If you're in Mavis, you bought that dip. You're definitely in green for the day. Yeah, let's get it. All right. Uh, AMC up 1.5% as of right now. Neo's up 1.6%. That's good. Mavis up 2.4%. MMAT up 3.3%. DD up 3.3%. That's crazy. DD and MMAT are both up the exact same. Uh, and ANY is up 13% and CARB is up 15%. So everything is green on my end. I don't know about you guys, but I'm green. And CTXR is actually break even. 0% is what it shows. So it's break even. Yeah, we are at break even. Sherry Baker's at work. Listen, William Size is trucking with you and listen, I know a lot of you work. I appreciate you just leaving me on while in the background. That's cool. What do you guys think about the music in the background? Nobody answered me. Is that is it okay? Should I turn it off? I can't tell. I can hear it in my I can hear it in my headphones. I kinda like it. Some of you might not like it. Down 40% on LKCO, 19% on Mavis. Hey, we're in the same boat, uh, Rick Dotson. I'm down about 40% on LKCO as well. Yeah, wait, how much am I down, actually? Yeah, I'm down literally. I'm down 41.2%, which sucks, man. But it is what it is. We're going to be back in the green in the next couple months, Rick Dotson. I promise you. I promise you. You can't hear it? All right, cool. I can hear it. Yeah, cool, cool. Yeah, making sure. All right, uh, yeah, let's check Carve real quick. Selling off here on Carve. That's fine. I mean, it's fine. It's healthy. Yeah, we're going to get rips and dips and selling off a little here. 1751. That's all right. That's all right. We got a new touch point up here at 1950. So we're going to need to close above structure, which, like I said, I probably put structure about right here, actually. Yeah, we put structure about right here where we're at. So we're above structure. Uh, we need to close. We need to close. One hour time frame looking good. All right, we're going to have a golden cross here pretty soon. We could dip back down to the 200 on carve, but we need volume, guys. I'm surprised we've even moved this much with no volume. Carve has literally none. All right, like less than a million. Yeah, there's less than, I think. Right now as it stands, okay, you know, okay, volume went up a little bit. 1.2 million. Finally over a million on Carve. People are stepping in, buying these shares. A lot more buys than sells right now. Yeah, okay, we do have a sell at $19. Someone's selling 1,208 shares at 19 bucks, so 
yeah i think we probably do get back up there hopefully this isn't a double top i would not want to see this come and become a double top that would suck 1590 on mavis trying to get above 1622 there's a lot going on in the market right now guys it's a good time to be in everything seems to be recovering a little bit it's been a brutal month or last month was just crazy brutal last month was crazy brutal july and early this month was just really really bad really red it was not a good month last month i'm glad that i took a break on the on the red months on the red month and not the green month that is not something i want to do i don't i, I want to be here for the green I want to be here for the red too, but if I'm gonna take a break, I'd rather be during red. Yeah, this music, I mean, I can't really choose the music. There's not much to choose from. Yeah, as far as music goes, there's just not a lot. Royalty free, uh, I just have like a royalty free, royalty free playlist. Yeah, so I just need something in the background, you know. Sandra's average on LKCO is 144. That's your average? Oh, you're so good on that. Yeah, 144? Yeah, no, you're way good on that. If your average is 144, you're a little in the red, but it's not going to go much further. Yeah, I, I can't see it going much further down. We might go down to about 130, maybe. Maybe not. You're about a dollar lower than me, Sandra, so shout out to you for making that. That's awesome. That's a good average. You're going to be very happy with that in a, in, a, in a year or so. If you can just long-term hold it and forget about it, you're going to be real happy with LKCO. Like, mark my words. Like They're getting contracts to, to help build smart cities. Like That's huge. That is huge. China does everything first, just so you know. They do everything first. They're going to be the ones doing the smart cities first. Guaranteed. So that's going to be a good long-term hold. All right. Uh, Mavis back up 1595. Probably going to get back up in the zone and find resistance again. I don't know if we break through before lunch, but we did get up here uh, where we need to be. We're at least up here around $16, guys. $16. We're up. A, it's a $4 swing in like three days. In like three days, $4 swing. That's really, really good. Lockup, what's up, man? Good morning. Good morning, a little late, but present. I'm glad we have some tunes in the background. Yeah, it's kind of cheesy tunes, but it's something. It's something. You guys have better averages than me on OKCO. I have a few shares in OKCO. My average is 151. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, look at LK... Look at XELA for Boston Ghost, please. I'm in at 255. He is looking for entry point. XELA. Yeah, let's look at it. XELA. I mean, obviously, I can't tell you when to get in legally, but I'll tell you right now, a break and a close above the golden zone is what I'd be looking for. If I was looking to get in this stock, that's what I'd be doing, all right? SMAs look good. Daily time frame still looks... Uh, you know, this could be a point of resistance. All right, just keep that in mind. I'm looking at the higher time frame here, getting a bird's eye view, but this could be resistance here. Okay, you could find some resistance right here. Look to the left. We got resistance. We got resistance. We got resistance. All right, so it has not really been able to break out of this golden zone, but twice. All right, but when it did, you saw it rip, right? So every time it broke out right here, went all the way up to what? 7790. This break and close went up to about 550. So. Yeah, if it breaks and closes the golden zone on the four-hour time frame, maybe even the daily, I would, you know, you get in for a swing trade here. But I wouldn't get in here. I wouldn't get in right now if it was up to me. I can't tell you when to do it, but I would not. If it was me and I was using my money, I would not get in right now. I would. I'd wait for the close of the golden zone because you see a fake out here, right? We went outside this golden zone, but it really didn't close outside of it, and you got faked out, faked out back down to the 50, all right? So I would wait for a close really above, probably above 355 is what make me feel comfortable. Look to the left here. You see 355 is right here at this double top where it couldn't get above, and we have resistance at 355. So a close above 355 is the safe play. You could take the play now if you want, if you think it's going to go up, or any close above the golden zone, really. But you see here, even the close above the golden zone right here, had a double top and it took it back down all right so i don't know i would wait for a close above 355 if it was me but because that almost guarantees you a rip up to structure which would be you know pretty decent for this stock so like i said it's not a bad time to get in now but my my play would be the safe play on this one i'd wait for a close above 355 that's just my opinion all right just from looking at it real quick yeah looking at it real quick that's what i would say Hey, James, why, when is AMC's earnings call with Adam Aaron's? I have no idea, to be honest with you, my friend. I don't follow AMC too closely, to be honest. 
uh, fundamentally speaking. I don't. I just follow the price action, so I'm not really sure when that is. I don't. Like I said, I don't really follow the fundamentals of AMC because, well, it doesn't trade off fundamentals. It trade. It trades off some random universal craziness that's phenomenon. I don't even know. It does not trade off fundamentals. Fundamentally, it's a ten dollar stock, right? So, I don't know. You might want to check Reddit. You probably find it on Reddit pretty easily. Apparently, the earnings call is on uh, August 21st, so coming up in about, what, two weeks? Something like that? Yeah, a little less. Uh, August 21st is the earnings call right here. So this is what you're asking about. It shows it here on TradingView at, uh, on August. Oh, I'm sorry, on August 9th. I apologize. August 9th. So today, I guess? I'm Wow. I guess not the 21st. I'm tripping. Uh, it's the 9th. So today, I guess, is their earnings. Yeah. Uh, thank you, Sandra Lay. Thank you, James. You're welcome, Boston Ghost. Yeah, you're welcome. Today is the earnings for AMC, I guess. Yeah, I guess. They're probably going to have some good earnings, I imagine. I mean, they've been making money. They've been uh, selling popcorn. Selling uh, $10 sodas. <laughs> you go to the movie, you better be ready to spend 100 bucks at the movies out here, I swear. You cannot see a movie and eat snacks for less than, like, $60, I don't think. I don't think. So if you're taking your lady friend on a date, or your man friend on a date... Or your sugar daddy or your sugar mama uh be ready to spend a, a, a cool hundred bucks to have a good time at amc ten dollar soda who doesn't like paying ten bucks for a soda rick dotson said you got a lower average than me rick dotson we're on the same boat rick we're in the same boat yeah, I know, Chuck. Trust me. I already know the, the old school tricks. Me, me and Ori, we've been there. Me and Ori have been there. Like, that's what, all we used to do is go to the movies. We would load up, dude. I'm not even playing. We would go to HEB and we would just load up on crap. Walk in there with her free. One time, I'm not even joking, guys. One time, we literally got, we got Subway sandwiches and stuffed them in her bag and they saw us smashing them in the movie and they, they literally told us we couldn't do it. They made us leave the movie. I'm not playing. We went in there with some, we, we've gone in there with Outback Steakhouse before, stuffed in her bag. I mean, we just, I'm never really spending money at, at the counter. It's so expensive, man. Yeah, it's crazy. All right, Mavis, 1587. Come on, Mavis. Take us up to the promised land, Mavis. Let's check Carve real quick. If you guys want me to look at something, let me know in the chat. I'll look at it for you. If I see your comment, if not, I apologize. Uh, if you want me to see your comment, it's a little bit easier. Just Even just a dollar super chat helps me see it, all right? I have the chat screen pretty small, but the super chat show up with color, so it's a little bit easier to see it through the chat. Uh, unwrapping a damn foot long in a movie. Dude, you have no idea. <laughs> I'm sure there's a lot of girls that have unwrapped a foot long in a movie. Oh my God, I got jokes. Oh, Trademo James got jokes. Thumbs up in the chat. That was a good joke. I'm not going to lie. That was a good one. There's probably been a lot of footlongs unwrapped in the in the dark movies, guys. Just saying. Oh my god. 1587. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, that's that's just great. Good stuff. Touche trade mode, James. Yeah, they have a full restaurant. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Chuck Taylor says, I buy a I bring in a two liter of cola and my own milk duds. Nice. Yeah, nice. I'm gonna pay five dollars or six dollars for a for a box of milk duds. Yeah, that's like a million percent markup. It's crazy. Yeah, all right. Uh 1585 on the ticker. Just hanging out, guys. Microvision's kind of stuck. Had a nice rip uh for the morning. So I'm not too sad about this rip, right? We're kind of consolidating at this point. You see the consolidation happening here. Not a bad thing, right? Consolidation never bad. Look at this rip. Look at this dip right here. All right, down to the golden zone. Then we have some consolidation and then the rip, right? So that's all right. I like consolidation. That is fine by me. That is fine by me. Nobody got my joke. Nobody nobody got my joke. Nobody got my perverted joke, really? I know some of y'all got that. Some of y'all giggled at that. Yeah, I know one of y'all laughed at that. Jeez Louise. I'll be here all night, guys. Drop the, drop the mic. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, let's see where we're at. All right. 
Uh, yeah, so car of 1760, nice little sell off here, but uh, looks like it might have found some support here at about 1760, so that's good. And we, you know, I'd like to see a golden cross happen here, to be honest. I would love to see a golden cross, yeah, finally play out here. Yeah, right, so we'll wait and see what happens. Someone asked, about, okay, uh, in the DM, who, uh, Johnny. If you feel inclined, yeah, and I'm just going to answer your question live because I don't want to type it because the keyboard's loud. Uh, I'd just rather talk because I'm lazy. Uh, if you want to send me a tip, uh, you can do it through Super Chat or you can do it through Cash App. Cash App Trade Mo James is my Cash App if you feel inclined to do that. Not asking for it, but if you feel inclined, you know, you sent me the message. So if you feel inclined, that's how you do it. Cash App Trade Mo James or you can do it in Super Chat, my friend. Either way, thank you very much if you decide to do that. Uh, guys, if you want to get on the Discord, it's discord.io slash trade James. Uh, that will take you directly to the community where you can chat for free in the public and uh, join the team if you'd like to do that. All right. All right, let's get back to it. Let's put this arrow a little bit closer so we can get some movement here. Yeah, uh, let's see here. Hood is up. Oh, man, I can't touch hood. I, I just can't do it. I can't do it from a morality standpoint. I just can't touch the stock. I hope they crash and burn, even though I know they're not going to. There's no way this is going. They're not they're not going under, guys. I wish they would. They're just not. They're just not. Yeah, I can't see him. I can't see him doing that. Man, uh, this says Coinbase could jump up to 16%. Coin, oh man, they're about to have earnings. Coins earnings are gonna be insane. If you're looking for a swing trade, this might be a good good spot to do it. Their earnings coming up on the 10th, so tomorrow. Yeah, so tomorrow they're getting earnings. This thing could spike off that, I'm telling you. Uh, they are probably going to report some insane earnings, guys. They crazy, crazy money being made with Coinbase. They are insane. Their revenue is probably going to be, you know, in outer space, I would imagine. Yeah, I would imagine. LKCO is making me sad. It's all right, man. LKCO is going to be a long term one. All right. If you're not if you're an LKCO for short term gains, you're going to be you might be disappointed a little bit. Uh, this is going to take some time. All right. They just won that lawsuit. People are just starting to get back in and see that, you know, they're making moves. Uh, EMAP Go just won an award. If you guys didn't know that, they acquired uh, LKCO acquired EMAP Go. All right. They just won an award. So, yeah, like I said, it's going to be a long term hold, but uh, it's going to be a good one. You're going to be happy in the near medium to long future. All right. Let's see. He says LKCO death cross in the four hour. Yeah, let's check it out. Yep, definitely possible here. Yeah, definitely possible, all right? But hopefully the 200 stays going horizontal and we get that quick cross, that quick cross, and that quick rip, all right? That's what we're hoping for. Now, maybe price does come back down to the trend line here, all right? Uh, it could definitely happen. But we did break out, so it doesn't look like there was much movement. So I'm going to go ahead and move the trend line like this, all right? We'll do it like that because, yeah, like I said, it doesn't look like there's much, uh, much movement here in LKCO. So hopefully this is one of those crosses that does something like this comes down and then comes up like this you get that cross that death cross that takes it the trend and then the trend line reverses off all right so hopefully that's how it happens can't predict it but that's hopefully that's the best case scenario for us at this point for the short term all right for the short term yeah for the short term let's see we got 95 people in here how many likes do we have on the video? I cannot see it. For some reason, it doesn't show it on my screen. How many likes do we have on this video? Is there 80 likes yet? Do we have 80 likes on this video yet? I can't see it. Stop it. Stop. 56. All right, let's get that to 80. Let's get that to 80 likes, guys. If you're listening right now, let's smash the like button. Help me out. Hook me up. Uh, give a dog a bone, you know what I mean? I'm in here doing my best, so give me the like so I can get up on the algorithm and get us some more people in here so we can get some more investors in Mavis, all right? Let's get it to 80. Get it to 80. We get this to 100 likes, I'll put another 1,000 in Mavis right now, right live on stream. We get this to 100 likes right now, I'll put another 1,000 in Mavis, all right? Against Ori's wishes. <laughs> Against Ori's wishes, I will dump another 1,000 right now. We can't tell her, right? We can't say anything about it. I'm going to say, babe, I don't know what happened to that $1,000. You must have spent it on food. I don't know. 100 likes, I dump 1,000. Yep, whale status. Yeah, let me know when we get to 100. I can't see it, so let me know when we get to 100. 1,000 bucks going in. 
don't care what the average what the price is either i'll put it in right now stop it go 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 get out of here you're irritating me roman yeah all right uh 100 do it no we didn't get no 100 let me check did it really jump to 100 that fast yeah no let me see let me verify i gotta verify this oh this freaking cat just bit the shit out of me he never bites me why did you just bite me stupid we got 66 likes i needed 100 100 likes i drop a thousand let's go all right lkco one point uh one point one dollar and 42 cents <laughs> mave is 1586 yeah let's go who's who's gonna match me that's what i want to know who's gonna match me and by the way don't follow me blindly <laughs> Who's going to match me? I want proof. We need 30 more likes. I'm dumping a thousand. Dude, this cat just bit the crap out of me. It's because I'm ignoring him. This, uh, Roman comes up to me. And he like rubs on me and like plays with me. He just bit the living crap out of me. Ow. You little bastard. I don't know what his problem is. He just bit the crap out of me. <laughs> He's never done that before. <laughs> and it wasn't like a nibble either it was like dude pay attention to me you piece of crap and then he bit me all right you're done get away from me yeah geez louise no he's not a, he's not aggressive like that he's just he wants attention he comes up he jumps up on me while i'm playing games and while i'm streaming and if i ignore him he gets pissed off yeah that's so i kind of have to not ignore him. What are, how many likes are we at? You guys can get this to 100. Let's get it. I want to put a thousand in. I feel like I'm doing something naughty, right? Like by putting this in. I'm being I'm being crazy. 81. We need 19 people, so I'll wait. Yeah, I'm gonna wait for 100. We get this 100 likes. I'm dumping a thousand. All right, 1597 on the ticker. Yeah, let's get it. Let's get it. MMA T up seven percent. Let's go. Yes. I hope you get unstuck. It's approaching structure here. Sandra, if you can get above 375 on MMAT, that is going to put you close to that 50. Maybe resistance, maybe you break above the 50, but I would like to see this break above 50 and see that 50 do that. Get that golden cross, you know what I'm saying? That's what I hope for for you. My calls on MMAT are done. I don't think I can win. I think it's over. They haven't moved. No matter how far this goes up, my calls stay the same. So I'm down 97% on my calls for MMAT. That's a $500 loss. Gosh dang it. Yeah, gosh dang it. Yeah, it is what it is. All right, 1602. Let's go. We are retesting this area up here. Retesting the zone. We need to break above and close above 1622 on the 30 or higher. That's the goal, all right? That is the goal. Nick Cordova says the cat is trying to kill him. I told you guys it would happen. It's it's beginning. It is beginning. Dude, he bit the crap out of me. <laughs> Freaking sharp teeth. He has the sharpest teeth out of all of them, too. God dang. He bit, and you know what's crazy? Like, my arm hangs off the desk. He jumped up and bit me right on the bottom side of my, like, my tricep area. So, like, the bottom side, like, the fatty part under my arm. Like, oh, my God. He got the good spot. Jesus. Yeah, he 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 bit the he bit the sensitive spot. <laughs> Dang. Yeah, the cat is bearish. <laughs> AMC not a dead cat. Yeah, no, AMC not a dead cat. <laughs> Sandra's flipping someone off. <laughs> I don't know who she's flipping off. Sandra's flipping somebody off. Let's get it, Sandra. <laughs> Yeah, all right. Uh, 1603 on the ticker. Take us up in the zone, Mavis. Let's go. Volume looking all right, guys. Volume is looking good for Microvision right now. I think we're at 7 million. Yeah, no, 5.5 million. 
but the reversal looks so nice so nice i'm gonna post this on the discord and my twitter real quick if you guys don't follow me on twitter you should because i'm gonna start using it at some point i don't do social media a lot but hey here i am trying to expand the channel all right uh let's do some uh let's i don't know let's post some of this i want to remove this real quick just for the just for the image yeah let me take a quick picture here yeah let me put this on twitter follow me twitter uh slash tremo james if you're interested in doing that yeah right i don't know what i'm doing here so i'm just gonna do this trace trade sent me a message trace trade sent me a message on on twitter all right we'll read that in a second yeah give me a second here uh let's see all right we're gonna post this need to break above 16 22 for the geezy golden zone touch yeah matter of fact i need to get a better picture here yeah let me get a better picture here let me zoom out i don't know if this is going to be visible matter of fact let's do it like this yeah we'll take this picture throw it up on the twitter let me get out of this real quick how do i delete this oh my god i gotta type this again 1622 for the race to the golden zone let's go mavis yeah there we go yeah let's get it tweet all right guys follow me on twitter twitter slash Tremo james twitter.com slash Tremo james whatever gonna start posting some ta there and stuff like that get people following so uh it is what it is if not cool if, if you do awesome thank you so much uh 15.99 on the ticker for mavis yeah how many likes we got can i put a thousand in yet can I put a thousand in yet? Yeah, that's all I want to know. Can I dump a thousand into the stock? Yes or no? What are we at? We got to be close to 90 at least. Yeah, I feel like it's close. 72. All right. We need 28 more likes. 28 more likes and I then I throw a thousand. Sandra's matching me. Yeah, let's get it, Sandra. Nick Cordova, what's up, man? You got called out, Nick. What's up? Glad you're here. The myth, the legend, Nick Cordova. 79 people in here, man. We got a small community in here. I like I like it that you guys show up like this. We don't have a thousand people watching the stream, and that's fine with me. We get a hundred, I'm cool with a hundred. A hundred feels good. Other than that, I feel like the chat would be crazy to have a thousand, two thousand people watching. Chat would be insane. I wouldn't be able to see any of y'all stuff. I already struggle to look at all your comments. If you have a comment, guys, and you want to, you know, support the channel, help me out. Oh, by the way, by the way, I think the memberships went live today, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, let me check to see if they went live. Yeah, let me see here. I might have to make them go live. I might have to do something on my, on my end. Yeah, let me check. Yeah, let me check here. Memberships. All right, these are getting turned on. Should I turn these on? Yeah, I guess I got approved. Let's get it. These are turned on. They got turned on live. Okay, they're live right now, I think. So if you guys want to do this, uh, I made a video about this. If not, do not feel obligated to do this. All right, this is just for people that want to support me in a monetary way. And you get some cool stuff. Uh, go watch my video about content creating and uh, these memberships, right? There's three different tiers, $3.99, $8.99, and $49.99. So do what you want to do. If not, seriously, do not feel obligated to do this. I just appreciate y'all for being here, all right? So memberships should be turned on. I have no idea how you guys can see them on your end. You'll have to figure it out if it's there on the stream. I don't know if it's there. But I did just turn them on, so it's there if you want to support me uh, in a monetary way. I would appreciate it. If not, thank you so much just for being here. 1611, baby. Let's go. 1611 on the ticker for Microvision. Trying to get above 1622. That is the goal. That is the goal. Let me see if that actually... Hold up. Let me see if they turn, how they turn those on. Do you guys see it now on the stream? Because I have no idea how memberships even work. I don't know if, if, the, if you click it through YouTube. I have no idea. I don't know what how you sign up for that. <clears throat> yeah no it's not for discord this is a separate thing nick uh, I'll, I'll give you guys the link to the video i made about it this is just for people who want to be who want special privileges in the live stream chat this has nothing to do with discord all right nothing to do with discord this is a different different scenario these are memberships on youtube it's kind of the same thing as twitch 
So if you want to support me in a monetary way and you want to help me out, help the channel out, you can choose from three different tiers, all right? Three different tiers. If you want to do that, do not feel obligated. All right, this is just there for people who really like me, <laughs> pretty much. All right, and you get some cool things. You get new gifts, <clears throat> excuse me, to use in the chat. You get some uh, You get some badges next to your name to show everybody you're a supporter and cool stuff like that, all right? Yeah, but it is open. Yeah, I don't know how to do this. Yeah, I have no idea how to do this. Who's going to be the first one? Yeah, I have no idea how to do this. So if you guys find it, let me know how you did it. So I know. 1608 on the ticker for uh, MVIS. Let's go back to Carve real quick. All right, Carve recovered a little nicely here. 1806 on the ticker. Come on, Carve. Let's see that squeeze happen. Let's see that squeeze happen. Oh, Sandra did it. Sandra's the first. Sandra, you see it now. She picked the whale tier. Guys, do not feel obligated, all right? Sandra done did it. You see the little stock thing next to her name? She is now an official whale of the channel. Three tiers on those, guys. Uh, basic, tier one, medium, tier two, and for the whales, tier three, all right? Pretty cool stuff. Not even just because of the money. I'm just happy I figured it out. Now Sandra's got the now Sandra's got a stock badge next to her name. Let's go, Sandra. I love you, Sandra. Thank you. You are awesome. Yeah, you're good like that. Nick, you're you're behind, Nick. She was the first one. Did it show up on here? That's pretty cool, man. That's cool that they do this. They needed to do something like Twitch. We got one. <laughs> Sandra. Thank you, Sandra. All right, 1603 on the ticker for Mavis. Uh, trying to get back up in the zone. Found some resistance here. Standard, right? We just, this is going to be the same scenario as 1485. Right here, same situation. We might even dip. So I think what's going to happen, history repeats itself, right? We probably dip back down to the zone and then we get that rip. That's what I think. That's what I think is going to happen. Just based off what happened at 1485, right? Key levels we're breaking here. Came up, dipped to the golden zone. Then we had the rip, right? So same kind of thing probably happening there, all right? Yeah, same kind of thing. Is that the link? Yeah, that's oh, that's oh, that's how you do it. Yeah, okay, okay, I see. Yeah, I see, I see. And I'm gonna be adding stuff in here, guys. Just so you know, the the the, the benefits on these. I just did something quick to turn it on, all right? But I will be adding things into these into these uh, tiers. Yeah, right now it's just basic stuff. But yeah, you there there will there will be some cool stuff in these tiers. I did not know that uh, this is where it is. Membership, okay, I see it. Yeah, I see, I see it. So you got to go to my link and then go to membership, and that's how you do it, I guess. All right, we'll, we'll stop talking about that. I'm not trying to pump that. I just want you guys to know it's there if you want to do it. All right, 1601 on the ticker. Re resistance here, the same zone. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven candles here of resistance on this 15 minute time frame down here. It took about, I think about the same. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So seven here it took. Seven 15-minute candles. Seven 15-minute candles. Then we had the dip. Then we had the rip. So maybe we have the dip, then the rip, right? Hopefully that's what happens. I just want to see us close above 1622 today. That is my goal for the day for Mavis. 1622 close. You all right? Oh, we got two whale, three whales in here. You guys did it. Sherry Baker, thank you so much. Nick Cordova, thank you, man three whales let's get it <laughs> let's go tier three i love you guys thank y'all i appreciate y'all very much sherry baker coming in strong sherry baker coming in strong nick cordova all right uh 1786 for carve you didn't miss carve just so you know you did not miss this it has not even done what it's probably going to do in the next month or two so it definitely didn't miss it uh right now we did close it well we're on our way to closing above the 50 SMA on the four hour time frame. That is what I'm hoping for with Carve, right? I want to see Carve close above the 50 and close above structure right here at $18, basically. All right. So we do that. We might get it. So we might get some movement tomorrow. Tomorrow might be the day Carve actually moves if we close above structure with some momentum. RSI on the four hour time frame is looking good. We have some room to go. So I think, yeah, no, for sure. Uh, tomorrow we could get some nice movement on Carve now that we're finally taking off. Reversal looks like it's in play. Uh, everything looks kind of good, so no volume, though. Still no volume. Yeah, and guys, just so you know, you don't have to do the whale. There's three tiers. I know somebody sent me a Discord uh, DM about it. There, the, the, short, the smallest tier is $3.99 a month, all right? 
$3.99, four bucks. Yeah, right. Uh, no Sherry's tier one. Oh, is it? Oh, tier one, tier one. Yeah, 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 sorry. I need to change the loyalty badges. Yeah, okay, so just so you know, as time goes on, the loyalty badges change, right? So the longer you are subscribed, the longer the 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 cooler the loyalty badge, right? That's kind of how it works. That's kind of how it works. But either way, thank you so much, Sherry. Yeah, let's get it. Let's get it. Yeah, all right. Uh, 1605 on the ticker for Mavis. Trying to get this bang down, man. This thing's got me super, super lit right now on caffeine. I think these bangs have 300 milligrams of caffeine. My God. Yeah, they do. Holy crap. This is like drinking like three cups of coffee i think yeah it really is yep 300 milligrams Whew. no wonder i feel so hot right now 1801 baby on carb let's get it it's good to be back guys i feel good streaming again i needed that little break i really did venmo trademo james my friend venmo trademo james cash app trademo james same thing all right no sherry do not be sorry don't you dare be sorry i don't don't you ever apologize you're way good I just thought that uh, the the loyalty badges were different, but they're not. Don't you worry about it. I appreciate you very much. Uh, Koan guy, like I said, uh, if you want to do anything, uh, the Venmo and the Cash App is the same. So trade Mo James on both. Yeah, right. Let's see here. Uh, we got 96. Did we get 100 likes yet? Because I'm ready to put 1,000 in. I kind of want to do it. I'm not going to lie. 76 likes. All right. Yeah, so we're getting there. We need 24 more likes for me to dump 1,000 into Mavis. You guys are listening, hit that like button if you want to see me put a thousand in. Yeah, Mr. Self, thank you so much, man, for uh, becoming a member. Thank you, my brother. Thank you so much. I hope you all become members. That'd be cool. All right, uh, MMAT is moving. Let's look at it. Oh, my God. Let's go. Yeah, it looks good. You're about to get this golden cross, Sandra, and anybody else that's the MMAT. You're about to get this golden cross on both time frames, 15 and the 30. All right, that's going to be good for the short term. I would like to see MMAT close above 375, right? That's kind of the number I told you guys, 375. And I think this golden cross right here could take y'all up there. Now, I just have call options with MMAT. I don't have any shares, but I know some of you do. So if you do, hold strong, all right? Diamond hand this thing because I'm telling you, it looks pretty good for the short term. It looks like it's recovering off this dip down to about 304. And right now, if it breaks these key levels right here, look on your screen. If it breaks these, like I said, these are key levels in this stock, all right? Support, support, resistance, resistance. When resistance becomes support, it, you're in for a run, all right? So this is a this is a key level of resistance right here, about 375. You break above that and close and start moving, you're going to get some movement, all right? RSI probably looks good too, I imagine. Very high, actually. I take that back. Very, very high. So we have resistance here with a high RSI. Could see a dip, potentially. I'm not going to lie. We could see a dip here. Yo, Brian, thank you, my friend. Thank you for becoming a member, Brian. I appreciate you. Brian is here, too. Thank you, brother. Yeah, thank you. DT, I did. I put more than 10,000. If you guys are watching the stream, thumbs up if you heard me put 10K in, because I did it. I promise you, it's in there. I, I dumped it in there at that dip. I told you guys I was doing it, too. I did it early, early. For, I think it was Monday morning. No, no, Friday morning. Friday morning. So whenever we were at like 1222, I think is when I did. I have to go back and look. But yes, I put that and more. I put about 14,000 back into this stock, guys, right down here. Right down here. Put about 14,000 in on the 4th. Or maybe it was maybe it was the 5th. I don't remember. Whatever day we ripped, that's the day I did it. Early in the morning at 3 a.m. Yep. I don't need to show proof, man. If you don't believe me, dang it. I don't know what to tell you. Yeah, everyone here knows I ain't playing games. All right. Uh, let's see here. Brian, thank you for joining as a member, man. I appreciate you. Uh, Mr. Self, thank you as well. Sherry Baker, Nick Cordova, and Sandra, obviously. Thank you guys very, very much. Does anybody know how much percentage YouTube take off the membership? Yeah, they take 30%. 30% of everything, <laughs> just so you know. Yeah, they take uh, whatever collective number you make at the end of the month. Like, they take everything into account. Super chats. They take memberships. They take views, uh, your ad count, and they take off 30% of everything. So, yeah, they, they definitely are making money off people for sure. But, hey, they gave me the platform to meet you guys, so I'm not too mad about it. It is what it is. Yeah, it is what it is. I think everyone in here knows I'm, I'm not lying about it. 
I definitely put about 14k in this thing. But I took about that much off uh, at the top up here. So I told you guys I was going to take a little off the top. Uh, actually, I took about nine. I think about eight grand profit up here. I took about 8,000 up here. And then I told you guys I'm waiting for the dip. I'm going to put it back in. I put even almost double that back in down here. So I'm my portfolio is looking real, real, real good right now. I can't wait for this thing to actually get up above the golden zone and make a new ATH. That's going to be freaking awesome. Yeah, I cannot wait for that. That's going to be really, really, really nice. If you're in microvision, shout out to you. You're in a good you're in at a good time. I'll tell you that much. Yeah, you're in at a good time. YouTube is a money money cow uh, money cow cash cow. Yeah, it really is, man. It's crazy. They make a crap ton of money off people. William Sight says 14k you did. I did, man. I told Ori, I said, babe, I'm putting this back in. She said, all right. She gave me the thumbs up. Oh my god. Thank you for the subscription uh to the channel, Mr. Mike4840. Thank you for subscribing to my channel. I appreciate that. Yeah, okay, Sandra, no worries. Nick Cordova says I bought 63 shares. $1,008. Loaded it up, Nick. Let's get it. Yeah, let's get it, Nick. Fifteen ninety-seven on the ticker. Trying to get above sixteen twenty-two. Still, like I said, guys, we're having a little bit of resistance here. Same situation. All right, same situation on Mavis. Need to get above sixteen twenty-two and close. That is my goal for the day for Mavis. Sixteen twenty-two and close. We likely see the golden zone by the end of the week if that happens. That's my prediction. Yeah. Yeah, Alex, I feel you, man. But hey, yeah, you know, I look at it like this. Like, they take 30% of everything I get. That's fine. Because they're giving me the platform to meet you guys and, like, do this. So I can't really be too mad about it, you know? Yeah, I can't be too mad about it. Yeah, I cannot be too mad about that, so... Oh, Nick, trust me. No, I need 100 likes. That was my stipulation. I'm probably still going to do it, but I need 100 likes. 100 likes on this video. I dumped 1,000. All right, we need 14 more likes on this video. If you're listening right now and you want me to dump 1,000 in Microvision, I need 14 more likes. Yeah, 1823. I'm sorry, 1801 for Carve. Uh, I'm happy for this movement with Carve, guys. I'm real happy about this, actually. This looks pretty good for us, all right? We broke above this 200 SMA. If you guys want me to look at your ticker or a stock ticker that you're in, let me know in the chat. Uh, throw a dollar super chat or something so I see it. If not, if I see it, I will look, all right? But the, the chat's kind of hard to see. Yeah, with the way it is. Charles Ingram says 70% profit take any time. Yes. Exactly, my friend. Yep, exactly. Yep, I'm, I'm about to match you, Nick. 13 more likes, I'm matching you. Yes, sir. Hey, Cal Nijin, man. Appreciate you, brother. Hey, uh, thank you for that 50 bucks, man. Cal Nijin just sent 50 to the Venmo. Thank you so much, my friend. Hey, send me a DM on Discord. I'm going to load you in the team. I know you weren't even trying to join the team, but now I got you. So uh, his comment says, Chick, Chick, what is it? Oh, Chick-fil-A Mavis supporting that Mavis community. All right, Cal Nijin. Thank you so much. I hope I read that right. Uh, if you want to get on the Discord, uh, Nijin, I got you. That was enough to do it, so... Thank you for that tip, and uh, you're going to be in on the team if you send me a DM on Discord. I got you. Yeah, I got you. I got you. Please, please send me a DM. I really appreciate you sending me that $50, man. I want to put you on the team, so send me a DM on Discord. Discord.io slash James. I want to get you on the team. Yeah, give me one sec, guys. Yeah, all right. Uh, Boston Ghost. Like I said, I just sent you a DM, Boston Ghost. So if you have Cash App, Venmo, or PayPal for the uh, lifetime membership, I can take care of it like that real quick, right? Let me know if you want to do it. Again, uh, Cal Nijin, thank you so much, man. 
Send me a DM on Discord. I want to put you on the team for that, all right? Uh, Fami shot up some also. That's good. Yeah, let's check Fami real quick. I am out of Fami, just so you guys know. I did liquidate my position uh, at break even, all right? So I liquidated right here at 46 cents, basically. Where was it? Whatever 46 cents was. I, I broke even on Fami. Not really willing to hold this for that long. Uh, but like I said, guys, this is a good long-term hold, all right? They're making all the right moves. Their earnings was freaking great. Look at their look at their profit, uh, 0 0.07 in the plus. So this is a good stock to be in. They're making all the right moves, landing all these uh, export contracts to Israel and you know Japan for shiitake mushrooms and stuff. It really is a good long-term hold, and I think at the end of it, you're probably likely at least double your money if you get in under 50 cents. All right. So, but I am out of it, just so you guys know. Carve jumped up to 1801. Oh, never mind. It was already at 1801. Trading view shows 1823 up here. A little trolly. A little bit of a troll troll move there, uh, trading view. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, uh, let's see here. Yeah, let me see if Nigen's in the Discord. Nigen, if you're in the Discord, let me know. I want to add you right now. Just type something in public chat for me so I can uh, adjust your perms and get you in the, uh, the golden zone, all right? Yeah, I appreciate you too, my friend, for real. Thank you. My mother-in-law's name. Yeah. Oh. Nigen. Nigen equals win. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Nah. He. Oh. He said no problem. Get that Chick Fil A. Oh man. Chick Fil A is so good. Yeah. That's that's gonna buy us a couple salads. <laughs> Appreciate you, man. Thank you so much. Yeah. All right. Uh. Let's see here. Let's go back to Mavis real quick, cause that's what we're watching. I'm gonna turn this. I don't like this song that much. Yeah. I'm gonna turn this one down. <laughs> Barrier Cockner says this music just makes me want to pop some Molly and bust out of the glow bust out the glow sticks. <laughs> I chose a random playlist, so I don't really get to choose what music plays, unfortunately. I like when the dubstep one comes on though. That one's fun. <laughs> yeah, did we hit a hundred yet? Gosh dang. 91 we need nine likes guys if you want me to throw a thousand hurry up so i can get a good entry hit that like button let's get eight let's get nine more likes real quick so i can dump a thousand in microvision right now yeah all right i'm gonna be doing that through the cash app so yeah let's see if we can get nine more likes on this video i i know antm trust me i know i'm with you antm i promise you i feel the same way about it that you do but their freaking salads are so good i can't even lie about it like i cannot lie chick-fil-a salads is so good i can't lie about it but i'm with you i feel you and i'm with you yeah trust me yeah trust me i'm with you there all right uh yeah let's see here where are we at where are we at yeah, let's check our volume again real quick. We're just hanging out, guys, watching these stocks move in our favor, finally, for once. Yeah, Mavis is up 3.6% for the day. 5.75 million in volume. Not as much as I thought, but it is still good. Basically, 6 million in volume, right? Big, big sell wall here at 1605. Have a 4,700 share order. Yeah, that's not too bad. That's a lot, though. And another 6,700 share order at to sell at 1620. So we're gonna make our way. It looks like we're gonna make our way up there. We got, we got another sell here at twenty dollars and thirty two cents, a thousand eleven hundred shares. So I think people are expecting this to go up, and it is gonna go up. It is gonna go up. Yeah, it's just a fact, undisputable fact. Mavis is on the on its way, guys. Yeah, Mavis is on its freaking way. Ninety eight. We're close. Oh my god. I'm gonna go ahead and get this ready because I know it's gonna happen. We need three likes, guys. Three likes. Let me, let me go ahead and set this up. Hold on. Yeah, I'm going to show you guys this. Well, I can't show it to you, but I'm, you're going to hear it, I think. Yeah, let me go get this ready. All right, Microvision. Uh, yep, yeah, let's see. Let's see. Bye. Yeah, I hope this makes a sound. I have my volume up. Yeah, okay. Make a sound, please. Do we got 100? Did we hit 100? Someone say yes or no. You know what? It's close enough. Bought. Bought right now. Share price, 1603. Yeah, let's get it. 
It didn't make a sound. Hold on. Yeah, all right. Build at 16.03. 62 shares, guys. 62 shares. Let's go. 62 shares added into my portfolio. Average on this trade, 16.03. So I'm okay with it. Wrestler Shoe says if I buy that, he'll buy one share. All right. So I bought a thousand. <clears throat> Nick Cordova bought a thousand. I don't know who else did it. Yep. Grand is in there. Just filled. I told you guys. It's filled at 1603. 62.38 shares. Yeah, right. We're good. We're, we're looking good. Adding, I have two accounts one Cash App, one uh, Weeble. All right. There we go. Yeah, who's, who's matching? Let's get it. Oh, okay. Sorry, John. <laughs> so, I guess I can't say uh, who's matching. So, all right. John's listening. <laughs> Shout out to John. John's always looking out. John is my lawyer. He's listening to this chat, apparently. I just got a text. All right, my bad, John. All right, I guess I can't say who's matching. Okay, I, I retract the statement. Do not match me. 1601, 1601 on the ticker. I'm just telling you guys what I'm doing, all right? Do not match me. Do not match me. I'm telling you guys right now, do not match me. I guess I have to say that. All right, uh, move, moving on. My lawyer told told you to buy. <laughs> I didn't even know he was listening. He texted me. He said, I'm going to be watching your streams every day to make sure you don't do anything dumb. I said, all right. All right. I'm known for doing dumb stuff sometimes. So, hey. Maybe it'll happen. Maybe not. I'll see you 66 and raise you 10. <laughs> yeah, nice. I'm going to read that on my personal time, uh, Critic. I will let you guys know what Trey said. Uh, Trey sent me a message on Twitter. I'm not going to read it publicly. I need to go back and read that uh, on the break or something. I didn't read what he said. I'll re I will report back. Hopefully, it's something like, hey, do you want to do a Microvision uh, duo stream? And I'm going to say yes. <laughs> Hopefully, it's something like that. Let's get some rockets flowing in the chat, guys. We got 93 people in here. Today's been a good day so far. I just added on 60. How many shares was it? 64? 62.3 shares to my portfolio for Mavis. Let's freaking go. MMAT up 11%. Yeah, let's get it. He talks fast and adopts cats. Yes. I better see some rockets up in here. Rockets in the chat. We're having a good day. Really, really good day. We're over $16 on Mavis, guys. If you were following this channel, you've been following my stream. I told you guys $17 plus. We're coming to get you. Hop on our backs. Hop on the train. All right. I told you guys we're coming to get you. All right. We're stair-stepping our way to that golden zone. Everything looks really, really good. And I can't even be mad about it. We're over $16 right now. That's awesome. Down here from $12.22 all the way to $16. That's a really, 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 yeah, really nice rib. $4.22 or $4, $4 swing there in a couple days. That's what's up. That is what we like to see. And we didn't even have that much volume today, so that's awesome. Sandra's using some of the new GIFs. Or no, some of those new emojis I put in. I made that, Sandra. I made that just for you, actually. That pink rocket right there, I swear to God, I made that just for you in, uh, in Canva. Also, uh, if you guys have any, you know, uh, custom gifts, I'm not gifts. If you have any ideas for the, uh, for the emojis that you want to use, I can make them. Just send them to me on Discord. Tell me your idea and I'll make it for you. I make you a custom uh, emoji if you want that only you can use on the chat. I will make it for you. Yeah, just let me know. Nick Cordova coming in with the new, with the new emoji. Those are ones I made, guys. All right, I made those really fast on Canva. But like I said, if you want your own custom emoji and you're a member, I will make it for you. Let's get it. 1595 on the ticker having resistance issues again, but that's all right We're just consolidating up here. No big deal. RSI probably looks pretty good. Yeah for the uh, shorter time frame Yeah, it does. We're still kind of low. We're not overbought yet. Just consolidating here. All right, so 63 6350 on the RSI not looking bad not looking bad Yeah, not looking too bad
YouTube says you have 102 likes and 94 watching. Yes. You guys see at the top above my logo, it shows how many people are watching. We got 95 people watching. Look at the top of the screen. There's the YouTube logo and then the 95. It shows 95 watching. That's what's up. Yeah, uh, Sandra says the join button is up top. Yeah, was somebody asking? Oh, Philip L., if you're talking about, uh, there's two different things. So you can join the, the Discord family. Uh, that requires a one-time pledge. But if you're talking about being a member on YouTube, yeah, just click that link that Sandra posted and you can choose which one you want to do there. All right. And like I said, I'm going to add some different stuff to the tiers and stuff like that. Uh, I think the higher the tier, you're gonna, you guys are going to get some discounts on merch, which I am going to do at some freaking point. I swear to God, I'm going to do it. I just have a lot going on and I don't have enough time to be doing it. I'm going to do it though. I promise you. Yeah, I'm going to do it. All right. Uh, I wish Ron was still around here. I'd tell Ron to make us some more stuff. Where's Ron at? I'm going to send him a DM today. Yeah, I really appreciate that guy. Uh, I still need, I still have two hats I need to send out. My God. All right. I got to do a lot of stuff. I got to catch up. I've been slacking the last month or two guys. I apologize so much, but I'm back. I'm here in action. Yeah, I appreciate y'all for being here. All right. Sandra, I'm riding in your Lambo. <laughs> Rudy love. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, that's funny. Yeah, I hope MMA does keep climbing. You see Annie. Don't remind me about Annie. I'm tilted about that. I got out with a $64 loss. Look at this freaking thing. A&Y is up 27% for the day. My God. I can't believe I sold too early. That sucks. Yeah, that sucks. That sucks. MMAT uh, 372. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, yes. Guys, Sandra, look at this, Sandra. If you guys get above 375, I'm telling you, you're going to see that rip. Look at this, Sandra. Sandra's about to get unstuck. Oh, my God. Sandra's about to get unstuck. Golden Cross here, both looking like upwards trending. All right. The SMA is pointing to the upside. Golden Cross, you get above this uh, 375 here. Probably going to jump up here to about. Four dollars and ten cents. All right, four dollars and eight cents. Right at this double top, you're gonna have some walls along the way. All right, hold on. Let me move this for you so I can show you. Uh, you got a couple walls along the way, but you know you start breaking these levels, you're probably gonna end up here around four dollars and ten cents. All right, this first one's this uh, 372. So close above 372, somewhere around 375. Gonna be great for you guys that are in MMAT right now. Yeah, right. I hope you. I hope you guys get it. I hope you guys kill it. He actually did invest in it. That's what's funny. I When I first did my consultation with him, like we did it over Zoom and I was just sitting there telling him about uh, Microvision for like two hours. And I I guess I sold him on it. I don't know. I had him read over the Reddit and all this stuff. So he, he didn't even know what Microvision was before me. So now he, he told me he did. I don't know how much how many shares he bought. John, if you're still in here, text me how many shares you bought. John, I'm interested actually now that they brought that up. But uh, he did tell me he bought some. So I'm just not sure how much he bought. Yeah, but he did. He did get some. Uh, let's see here. Are the shorts covering MMAT? Let's check Fintel. Yeah, let's check Fintel, my friend. Yeah, come on, internet, you slow internet. Oh my god. Yeah, there we go. Fintel, MMAT. Yeah, let's see. Let's see how many shorts there are as far as Fintel is concerned. Yeah, oh, 1.1 million. Yeah, it looks like they did cover a little bit. Four hours ago, I remember looking, there wasn't this many. So, yeah, it looks like they are covering a little bit. Maybe you guys get that squeeze you've been waiting for. I really hope you do, man. I really hope you guys do. I hope you guys crush this. If you're an MMAT, I hope you crush it. 1.1 million. 1.1 million. Yeah, all right? Cal, uh, Koan Guy says, dang, I like this community. Learning all these small caps. I'm usually a value stock guy. Hey, there's a lot of money to be made in these small cap stocks. Uh... Nigel, I promise you, uh, especially the ones that we talk about, there's a lot of cash to be made. All right, the big cap stocks, you can make money too, but you got to have a lot of capital, right? You got to have a lot of capital, like hundreds of thousands, and you're probably going to get 2 or 3% a year, which is good, right? Like most big cap stocks pull 3% a year pretty easily. So let's just do, what's 3% of, yeah, let's just, I mean, let's say you have 200 grand in the market. What's 3% of 200 grand? Yeah, what is that? So 6,000 a year. So if you have 200,000 in a big cap stock, you're likely going to make 
five to seven thousand dollars a year return on it likely i think that's usually pretty standard right three percent i believe uh yeah so like i said there's a lot more to be made in the small cap stocks i mean some people don't have a uh, big capital like this to be putting in one stock right so but a lot of people do not me all right i'm playing the small cap stocks this year and it's been working out in my favor all right there's a lot of money to be made here yeah for sure boston ghost thank you for being a member on youtube man join the tier two what an og boston ghost thank you my friend very very much welcome him to the youtube team you now have some, you now have access to uh special gifts special emojis and you also get a uh, discount on merch when i get it going so thank you my friend thank y'all very much yeah you guys are awesome thank you so much if you guys want to join the youtube team uh it's different than discord all right this is basically just a way to support me and my channel all right uh the discord community that's for you guys the youtube membership that's for me all right you guys get some cool stuff but really it's just a way to support uh your favorite streamers all right and here we are so sandra lay coming in with the moons yes the freaking moons let's get it antm's from boston that's what's up i've never been to boston i've never been to boston all right, MMAT up. Uh, let's see here. How many how much percent? 11.2% for the day. Let's go, MMAT. Yes, 368. Having some resistance here at this at this key level, all right? We need to get above 375 on uh, MMAT. Yeah, so 1.1 million, uh, 1 .1 million available on Fintel. So, yes, it looks like some shorts have covered. Yeah, it looks like some shorts have covered. Thank you for that $25 to my Cash App. Terry, thank you very much. I appreciate you. Yep. I actually have to call somebody real quick. Give me 30 seconds, guys, to make a quick phone call. Do not leave. If you leave, you don't love me. Give me one second. Yeah, all right, that was quick. All right, uh, Ben Duhan says, how do I join the YouTube community as a tier two? I'm subscribed, but I don't know there was a difference. Yeah, so I just activated that today, actually. So if you go to the link that Sandra posted, Sandra, if you don't mind posting the link again, I would appreciate it if you can, Sandra. Uh, you click the link and then you click memberships and then you can choose which tier you want, my friend. All right, that's how you do it. And like I said, it's really just to support me. Do not feel obligated to do it, please. But if you want to, it's there. All right, 1601 on the ticker for Mavis. MMAT 368. Let's check LKCO because that's one of my babies. And I feel like she's going to rip here pretty soon. LKCO is at a very, very low point, guys. All right. Down here on the RSI, pretty low. 42 on the RSI. On the 15, the four hour is what I like to look at for LKCO because this is kind of a slow moving stock right now. But the higher time frames hold much more weight. All right. So we are low on the RSI here, about 39. So it's not technically oversold yet. I think we probably come down to trend line here. But when we break out of the top side, here likely the rsi will dip to the upside and we get this quick double cross so we get the, the death cross here real fast that's going to take us to trend line then we get that jump and that's going to elevate us hopefully back up to around three dollars that's what i'm hoping for for lkco rick dotson lkco what's up nick needs a cactus all right i'll make a cactus emoji for you guys yeah i'll make a cactus emoji really loves as i'm making so making so much money on board <laughs> i can never be bored with that yeah, that's so funny. Ben Duhan says, well, you've supported us. I should support you. Hey, I appreciate that, man. Thank you very much. Yeah, I appreciate you. Much love. If you guys want to join the Discord community, it's discord.io slash trademojames. That will take you straight to the Discord community with an option to join the members area. If not, the public area is free, all right? Uh, let's see here. Where are we at? RSI still looking good on Mavis. Price is held up here, guys. This is what I'm talking about. We are consolidating here. Little flag pattern. All right, you see it happening with the consolidation on the RSI. <clears throat> yeah, it looks pretty dang good. Looks pretty dang good. Yeah, all right. No uh, divergence here yet on the 15. If we go up to like the four hour, let's see if we can find some divergence here. Yeah, let's see if we can find some divergence. I don't see much. I don't see any divergence really. Yeah, no, no divergence on the four hour. So not bad. Just wish we had some. 
Yeah, I wish we had some. Nice little flag pattern here, though, guys. Always, always good to see a big rip. You see the base of this? You see this candle right here? Just rip up, all right? That is what we're looking for. We're looking for a nice rip and then a flag pattern of consolidation in and around a supply and demand zone. This is a supply zone, all right? This is a known supply zone. We've fallen off this zone a few times. The banks have clearly moved the money here before, all right? So we know this is a supply zone. And like I said, I love to see consolidation in and around supply and demand zones. That is my Forex strategy. I use that in Forex. It works like a freaking charm. And it does work in the stock market too. So like I said, I don't mind consolidation uh, around the supply zone, especially in a flag pattern like this. We break to the top side, likely going to see a, a close above 1622 today, I hope. I think it's going to happen. Yeah, right? So let's see. Mr. Self says, I'm so upside down on MMAT. I think they're coming for you, my friend. Ben Duran says, I learned about divergence from Chris at Gator Traders. That's what's up, man. That is what's up. We always want to see some bullish divergence, guys. That's when RSI shows different than price, right? So if RSI is low and price is high, that's divergence. If price is high and RSI is low, that's divergence, right? Understand divergence. It's very important if you're looking at RSI. You can definitely do some, some nice call-outs and predictions just based off uh, divergence alone. You know you know, a rip's coming or a dip's coming, depending on what you see on the RSI and the price. So that's just called price action, guys, right? Naked price action. That's what I use. I have these lines drawn in here for you guys. All these key levels I have for you guys. If I'm trading on my own off stream, I don't even need these lines. I just look at the price. I look at the levels. I might check RSI and the SMAs, and then I, you know, I go from there. But these lines are for you guys. These golden zones are for you guys. All right, I've already done this enough. That I don't need to draw them in at this point, but uh, I know it's a good visual aid for you guys that are learning. So that's why we keep it here. Steroid Bryce says, I became a member this weekend. You're talking about Discord? Yeah, you're talking about Discord. Uh, did you? What was your name on Discord, my friend? Yep. Blanky, what's up? Yeah, Cowan, uh, Koan guy. I hope I said that right. I hope I didn't blotch that. Uh, botch that. All right. Uh, type uh, lifetime in public chat for me so I can adjust your perms and get you on the team. Thank you, man. I appreciate you. And it's even better because you weren't even trying to join the team. You were just sending me 50 bucks because you're a good dude. So I really appreciate you. I'll throw you on the team. I got you right now. Yeah, guys, welcome Blanky to the team. That's Cal Nijin. I am adding him right now as we speak. Thank you, my brother, and I'm glad you're here. Glad to have you on the team, all right? Yeah, let me get you in here. <clears throat> yep. Oh, one second. Oh, my God. I'm already messing up. Yeah, I'm trying to do this fast. All right. Your diamond's coming, my friend. Diamond. Yeah, let's get it. Blanky, if you want your name change, just let me know. I'm going to put it like you uh, have it right now. If you want it different on Discord, just tell me. I'm the only one that could change your name on this on this server. So if you want it different, just let me know. You should be able to see the Golden Zone now. I'm going to welcome you to the channel. And uh, make yourself at home, my friend. Uh, make some friends. Meet some people. Use the channels. Uh, do whatever you want to do in here. I appreciate you for being here. Yeah, I hope I spelled that right. Yeah, everybody welcome him to the team, please. If you're in the Discord, uh, give him a warm welcome, all right? Every time you see someone get added, I would really appreciate if you guys uh, gave them a, a nice warm welcome. Let them know how we get down. Yep. Yeah, all right, let's see uh, who's in the chat here. Yeah, where's the membership icon? Yeah, it should say uh, you should have three tiers, uh, Auntie M, if you're trying to do the YouTube thing. It should be right there. You click members. I'll, I'll open it for you. Oops, that didn't work. Yeah, let me look. Let me look because I don't really know, to be honest with you. Yeah, I think you just click members, click membership. Yeah, and then you click uh, which tier you want, I believe. I'm not too sure, to be honest. I just It just went live today, so I don't really know. I'm sure Sandra can help you out. I just don't really know. I apologize. <clears throat> Yeah, uh, Sandra, if you want to help Auntie M out, I don't really know.
Yeah, let me see if I can pull it up for you. So yeah, so if you go here, um, hold on. Yeah, this, okay. So go to my YouTube, click my icon, and then click membership. Yeah, and then from here, I think you, I think you might just click join. Right here, I think it says join, right? I think that's what you click. Yeah, yeah, okay, so that's what you do. So go to my YouTube, click the uh, the icon, take you to my actual page, and then click membership, and then from there you click join, and you can choose which tier you want, all right? And I'm going to add some new stuff in there over the coming days, all right? <clears throat> yep, that's how you do it. Yeah, right. 1588 having a little bit of a sell off here on Mavis. That's okay, though. We're still in this uh, little flag pattern here. I'll draw it in a little better. Yeah, because these green lines kind of. Yeah, they're not very accurate. Let me let me make these a little bit better. Yeah, we'll do it like this. Yep, there we go. Oops. Yeah, there we go. All right. Yeah, nice little flag pattern here. We'll see We'll see which way we break out. If we break out to the bottom side, we're likely to come down to about 1560. Yeah, all right, down here to structure. If we break to the top side, we'll probably end up back up in the zone. So that's where, that's kind of what we're waiting for here. Yeah, all right. Uh, yeah, let me see here. Yeah, Philip L., uh, I'll, I'll go through it one more time with you guys. Yeah, check this out. I'll send you the link right now. Yep, here's the link. Yeah, here is the link. Click that link, all right? Click that link. It's gonna take you to the membership page, right? Click join, that's all you gotta do. So I just posted a link right here. Here's the link. Yeah, click that link right there and it should take you to the membership page from there under my logo to the right, you just click join and then you choose your tier. That's all you gotta do. Yeah, it's right there. We figured it out. We figured it out. Yeah, let's get it. Yeah, all right. Uh, little recovery here. 1593 on the ticker for Mavis. Uh, MMAT 369. So still having some resistance here at this uh, at this key level on MMAT. Yeah. One second. Got to make a phone call to the realtor. Jeez, Louise. Give me one sec.
One sec, guys. I'm almost done with this phone call. Give me one second. My apologies. All right, guys, I'm back. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm here. Yes, I'm here. Sorry about that. Yeah, all right, let's get it. Uh, let me see, let me see. Yeah, let me see, let me see, let me see. You can't see the screen properly. Yeah, hold up. This is the link right here. This is the screen. Yeah, I'm trying to help you guys get here. Look on your screen real quick. Uh, you just go to my YouTube and click join. That's really all you got to do. It should be there. Yeah, sugar baby, uh, you should be able to see it. If you click that link, you don't even have to click the link. Just go to my YouTube and go to my actual page where it shows, you know, home videos, playlists, and all that stuff. And then you just click membership here and then click join if you want to do it. That's how you do it. It's right here. I'm clicking it for you. So you click this and then you can choose which tier you want. All right. Yeah. So Nick, uh, I got to set you guys mod status up. I know Nick did whale. So I got to set you up, Nick, with the mod status. 1585 on the ticker approaching the bottom of this uh, little flag pattern here. Hopefully we don't get a big dip, but if we do, we might come down to structure, and that's all right. All right, that's okay. Not the end of the world. We had a nice candle here. Expect a retracement, all right? A 50% retracement off this candle, off this move, really, would put us back down about 50% would put us back to about 1556. All right, that's not bad. It's not the best, but it's not it's not the worst either. Yeah, all right? It's not showing on some. I apologize. Yeah, maybe reload it. I had to reload. I don't know if you guys, but I had to reload the page to see it. Yeah, so if you click that link and just reload your page, you should be able to see it. For those of you trying to do it, it's right there. Yeah, just click that link and it should bring you right up. Right, I'm going to do it for you guys. So you, I put that link right here in my browser. And I press enter. Then right here next to, I see it as join. That's how I see it. I don't know where you guys see it, but that's how I see it. All right, 1603. Oh, nice recovery. Let's go. Right off the bottom of this trend line, guys. You see how this played out? You see how this played out right at the right off the bottom of that trend line. Nice rip here back up over $16, 1603 on the ticker. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not really sure. Yeah, how to how to find it, guys. I know some people have found it. Yeah, let me see if I can do it on my end. Yeah, you guys will find it. You'll figure it out. Yeah, it's right there. I don't want to jump too far into it because it might take a minute, but you guys will find it. It's right there on my YouTube channel. You will see it. If you go to my actual page and go to the uh, the default screen right here where it shows everything, yeah, you just click join right there. Should be right there. Should be a uh, little button right there. 1603 on the ticker. Now we're at the top side here. All right, RSI on the 15-minute time frame. Looks like it's headed towards the upside. I think maybe we get a little rip here to the top side. Re probably retest 1620 1622 hopefully looking for a close above that that's what we're looking for yeah that is what we're looking for all right mtm no worries don't even worry about it yeah it's not a big deal yep uh let's see rudy love says love all i love you guys lambos for everybody <laughs> let's go yeah let's go let's go yeah let's go blanky yeah i see you here buddy welcome to the team my friend If you guys want to play play some casino in the Discord, I made a, a casino channel. I love to gamble. I love to play stuff like that. So you can go in there, play blackjack, roulette, slots, all that stuff. Uh, if you're a member on the team, you can go down to the casino channel and play. You get like 5,000 free credits. And if you run out of credits, every 22 hours, you can spin the wheel by typing plus wheel, and you get a chance to win like, I don't know, a million credits or something. I think on my first spin, I won like 20,000 credits. So yeah, if you run out of credits, you got to wait or buy gems. And I don't get the money that goes through whoever whoever coded this uh, this bot. So 
Yeah, you have the option there if you like it. Yeah, right? I know Water Gummy's addicted like me now. I see you guys in there spinning the blackjack. Let's get it. <laughs> yeah, let's get it. Let's get it. I saw you, Water. Whenever you did that big spin, I was like, all right, Water Gummy, see you at the bar, my friend. We're down 180k. See you at the freaking bar. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, all right, let's look at Carve. Someone said Carve is popping off. Yes, Carve, yes! Let's freaking go! 1889, let's go, Carve. Oh, my God, finally. Yes. Look at this Golden Cross about to happen here on the 30 minute. You see this 50 SMA trucking along. Coming up to that 200. Let's go. Thank you, Carve. Let's freaking get it, man. Yes, I want to get unstuck with Carve. I don't even care if it squeezes. Just take me to unstuck so I can get out of this thing. Yeah, we're almost there. I'm only down 686 on Carve now. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, I'm actually mad that I can't find this thing on YouTube. How do you guys... How did Sandra and them find it? Yeah, that's weird. Let me see. Yeah, give me a second here. Yeah, how do I log out? Settings. Yeah, there it is. Log out, right? Ay, ay, ay. Yeah, I'm trying to... Yeah, I'm trying to log out here. All right, let me go to this... Let me figure it out now. Yeah, right. That yeah, that didn't work. Uh Okay, yeah, so if you go to my YouTube, there's a next to the subscribe button, there's a, a button that says join. It's in blue letters. If you're on your mobile, if you're on your phone, just go to my YouTube and go to home and uh click the join button is right next to where it says subscribe. So you must subscribe on YouTube first to be able to do that. Just so you guys know, I'm trying to figure it out for y'all. I know a few of you are trying to do it. Yeah, but you gotta, uh, yeah, you gotta click join on the uh, right next to my logo, and then you'll from there you'll be able to choose your tier. Okay. Yep, you'll be able to choose your tier. All right. Uh, Fidelity shows carve at 1910. My trading view isn't updating. Let me see. Let me see. I'll be happy as hell if it's 1910. Yeah, it is. Oh, let's go. Oh my God. Let's get some rockets for carve. 1920, baby. Let's squeeze it. Squeeze it, squeeze it. Yes, take us above structure, and let's just rip here. Oh, my God. And we don't even have any volume either, guys. We have no volume. No volume on Carve. 1.7 million. Nothing. Yeah, absolutely nothing. Yeah, give me one second. Yeah, let's get it. Yeah, search YouTube for trade mode James. Yeah, let's get it. Bullish post. Yeah, hopefully we get some more people in here from, from Weeble Chat. 1591 on the ticker on Microvision just bouncing up and down in this little flag pattern here. RSI still not overbought. Still looks pretty good. Have some room to move. Yeah, all right, we're looking, we're looking good. Not bad. Oh my God, carve 1943. Let's go carve. Hell yeah. Yes, rockets in the chat. Let's go. If you're listening to this i want to see some rockets flowing in this chat right now if you're in carve shout out to you if not shout out to me because i'm in carve and i'm getting unstuck here yes free up some more money for mavis baby i'm not in carve too deep i think my original investment in carve was like 2000 i think yes uh 2300 so 2350 so i have 2350 total invi uh total invested in carve i'd like to get unstuck and uh sell that and put it all in mavis yeah that's kind of what i'm looking for so i'm only down 678 bucks as of right now yeah with carve so not too shabby not too shabby at another level of resistance here look to the left we got some resistance along this line so maybe uh yeah we we have a little dip here but if not we might just bust through we're gonna see this golden cross in the 15 minute time frame here so i think guys uh i can't tell you to do this right legally i'm not a financial advisor please understand that all right but right now would not be a bad time to hop into carve all right you're uh, you're about to get a golden cross on both time frames 15 30 and even the one hour so 
I mean, you get golden crosses happen on all three time frames, likely going to see a jump to the upside. So if you wanted to scalp this, this is a great scalping opportunity with Carve, right? It just is. So if you're if you're into that kind of thing, this might be a good spot for you to do it. 1943 on the ticker right now as it stands, all right? Yeah, not a bad time to do it. Yeah, not a bad time to do it. <clears throat> yeah, is this seriously playing the same song over and over? Hold on. Yeah, let me change this. Yeah, we need a different song here. Where is that? Yeah, where is this? Yeah, what song is this? Yeah, okay, we'll leave it like that. That's fine. Yeah, trading view lags a little bit. Yeah, trading view does lag. That's like one downside to trading view. It lags a little bit on the printing of the candles, but that's fine. It's just a couple seconds behind. Yeah, not really a huge deal. Not a huge deal. Unless you're using it to trade, you know, off your, you know, if you're using TradingView to chart and then you're trying to apply it to your trading account, uh, you can link your trading account to TradingView, just so you know. Yeah, you can link it here, if you, depending on which one you have. All right, 1943 on the ticker for Carve. Nice. Yeah, let's go, Carve. Let's get it. Yeah, let's get it. Let's get it. And a lot of people send me a DM about the uh, membership. But guys, you gotta, you gotta, uh, you're gonna have to just go to the YouTube and try to find it. I'm not really sure why it's not showing up, but a couple people have found it, so I know it's there. Uh, you're just gonna have to go to YouTube and look at my channel and try to find the join button for the memberships. Click memberships, it should be right there. Yeah, uh, use the phrase in my opinion. Yeah, no, in my opinion, for sure. In my opinion, this is a nice, this is a nice spot to get in for a scalp. Nice spot to get in. Now you might see a dip here. Don't get bad. You might see a dip. I don't know if it's going to dip or not. It could. Be careful. Yeah, don't trade anything you're not willing to lose. That's facts. Yeah, 33.19 on AMC. Not bad. Holding up right at that golden zone, obviously. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. We have a new sub. 22.63. Let's go. Nice. Thank you, whoever joined uh, the channel. The subs have been slow lately, but that's all right. I haven't really been uh, streaming that much. I've gotten back on track the last week or so, so we're going to get it back up. I'd, I'd like to hit 5,000 subs. That's kind of the goal for me, right? 5,000 would be awesome. So 2263, we're about 45.26% to my goal of 5,000 subs. Word of mouth helps a lot. So if you want to spread the word, I would appreciate it. All right, back over $16, 1601 on the ticker. RSI holding up strong this whole way. All right, 62 on the RSI. Not bad. Not bad at all. Yep, not bad at all. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just looking at this real quick. I, I don't even know how to do this. Yeah, all I know is I see the join button here. For all of you that are DMing me, yeah, I, I don't have a, I don't know. Welcome Boston Ghost to the team. Yeah, Boston Ghost, welcome to the team, my friend. Appreciate you. Uh, type lifetime in public chat for me, and I will hook you up. Yeah, right meow. Yeah, right meow. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, you guys, you got to click membership. You got to click on that membership. Uh... Yeah, on my channel. I know a lot of you have sent me a DM right now. Just go to my channel and click memberships at the top. It should be a white link in between community and channels. You click membership, then you'll be able to click join and choose your tier, okay? Yeah, that's what it takes. Yeah, that's what it takes.
Yeah, where's Carve at? 1943 still for Carve. Nice. 1604 from Avis. All right, guys, we did just break out. Look at this. Look at this thing run. This is why consolidation in and around supply and demand zones works. All right, we just broke out of this uh, little flag pattern here. RSI has some room to go up. I likely think we're going to at least come up and test 1622 again. So you guys see it moving here. 1610 on the ticker for Mavis. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Boston Ghost. Uh, yeah, I appreciate you typing lifetime. Type lifetime in the Discord public chat for me, not on the stream. Uh, you have to do it in the Discord on the public chat so I can click your name. It won't let me do it any other way. I don't know why. So on Discord, on the left-hand side, there's a little thing that says public chat. Click that, type lifetime, and I'm going to hook you up right now, man. I'm glad you're here. Thank you so much. Yep, thank you so much. Yo, what's up, Joseph Yoon? What's going on, my brother? Yeah, glad to have you here. Thank you for showing up. No, Boston Ghost, you're way good. No worries. Do not apologize. Uh, I know Discord can be a little uh, overwhelming at first. Yeah, so I get it. On the left-hand side, you will see something that says public chat. Just click that and type it in there, and that's where I will be able to adjust your perms for the Discord, man. Yeah, appreciate you. Yeah, I think I yeah, I think I see you in here now. If you're on the team, yeah, man, thank y'all for being here. Thank y'all for showing up on the Discord and keeping the keeping the chats flowing, keeping the channels going. Show some of your show some of your skills. Uh, I don't see Glenn in the stream ever these days, but he's on the Discord, so yeah, keep doing what you guys are doing, man. I really appreciate it. Um, Boston, I'm hooking you up right now. Give me one second. Yeah, I got you. I'm doing it right now, Boston. Welcome to the team, my friend. Yeah, welcome to the team. Diamond. Oops. Yeah, you got your diamond. And Boston Ghost. Welcome to the team, my friend. Now on the left-hand side of the Discord right now, you should be able to reload and see the members area, all right? Guys, welcome Boston Ghost to the team in the members chat, please. I appreciate you. Uh, always, if you see somebody join the team, please welcome them. Welcome Boston Ghost to the team. Yes, welcome to the team, my friend. Yeah, let's get it. All right. Yep, here we go. Uh, 1611 on the ticker for microvision 1943 stuck at 1943 on carve that's all right i'm okay with that yeah nothing bad about being at 1943 yeah let's go <laughs> yeah let's go let's go joseph Yoon says it seems like there's a sector rotation in small cap stocks from value stocks we see a lot of small caps running right now largely the speculative ones yeah they're all really running right now yeah they're running yeah, Mavis's chart looks insanely bullish. Yeah, it really does, man. Looks really good. I'm so stoked about this. Yeah, I'm, I'm really happy right now. Mavis looks awesome. Definitely probably going to test this golden zone. I would I would find it very weird if Mavis came back down and, you know, broke below these SMAs right now on this run. I'd be very, very, very shocked. Yeah, that would really li just literally make no sense. Yeah, to be honest. Yeah, let's get it. Day trading. Uh, look at Carve. You're looking for a good day trade. Carve is a good spot. You might see a little dip here on Carve here pretty soon. Yeah, but if you get a dip down to like this structure down here around this 200 SMA, that would be a really, really nice spot to, uh, yeah, to get in. In my opinion. Keep in mind, I'm not a financial advisor. And not even that low. I'm sorry. It's not going down that low. Down here to structure somewhere around 1815. If it does dip, if it does dip down here to structure 1815, maybe somewhere around 1740. But I don't know if it's going to dip that hard. We'll see. 1606 on the ticker for Mavis. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, trading view is not updating for me then. Yeah, you're right. Carve 1864. You're right. Yeah, you are right. Carve is not updating on trading view. I don't know why. Let's reload this. Yeah, let's try this. Yeah, let's see if I can reload it and pull it up with the actual. Not trading view still shows 1943. Yeah, so I don't know. Yeah, I don't know what that's about. 1864 on Weeble. Weeble shows carve at 1864. Yeah, so likely if it's right here, 1864. 
Yeah, you gotta you pretty much had to dip down to the top of the structure. Yeah, like right here. We'll see if we recover off it. Yeah, we will see. Sean Craft, what's up, man? Yeah, thank you for being here. Did you guys figure out the membership thing on YouTube? If you didn't, let me know on DM on Discord. I'll try to help you uh, when I get a chance. Yeah, when I get a chance, I'll try to help you out. But it should be right there, man. It should be right there. It really should. Like, it should just be right there on the home channel on my Discord. Yeah, I see it right there. Join, right? Yeah, you guys see it. You gotta click join. Yeah, let me see if I can... Yeah, maybe make that more visible. Alright, here it is. Finally updated. 1869. Yeah, 1869 for Carve. It updated. Finally. Sixteen eleven for Mavis. Trying to come up and test that sixteen twenty two. Come on, Lady Mavis. I'm not calling her a baby no more. She ain't a baby no more. Yeah, she's a lady. She's a young lady. Yeah, maturing nicely. Maturing real nicely. Yeah, let's see here. Monetization. All right. Yeah, so memberships are set. Yeah, you should be able to do that. Yeah, you should definitely be able to do that. Yeah, nice. All right, so we got six people to join. Thank you all very much. Yeah, everybody that's joined uh, the YouTube team, thank you. I appreciate you. Yo, let me try this. Oh, try this one. This is the actual link it tells me to share. Here, try this link, guys, if you're looking to do that. Try that link. There you go. Try that link right there. Yeah, that should work. Yes, okay, that's the link. That's the link. That one definitely works. Click that link. Yeah, if you want to do it. Uh, who was that? Was it, uh, who was it trying to do that? Auntie M. Yeah, if you're trying to do it, click that link right there. That should work. Yeah, that should do it for you. All right, 1869 on Carve, 1613 on Mavis. Trying to get up here. We're just watching. We're just hanging out, chilling, watching. Let's check the MACD. MACD probably looks pretty good. Yeah, about to get across on the MACD. Let's go, MACD. Yeah, we need this blue line to cross above the orange line. That's when we're going to see a move. Um, MACD looks healthy. Yeah, it looks real healthy. Yeah, we just need to get that cross. One hour MACD looks good. Might slow down a little bit here at resistance, but it still looks pretty healthy. Yeah, it really does. Yeah, I'm still here. We're going to stream till about noon, guys, about 12 o'clock. I have a session, and uh, I'm going to have to uh, teach some price action to somebody. If you guys want if you guys want one-on-one -on -one price action training, please send me a DM on Discord. I do that as well. If you want to learn the basics or whatever you want to learn, if I know it, I can help you learn it, all right? Um, send me a DM on Discord for that if you want to set up a one-on-one -on -one session. Yep. I'm going to rip the intro. Yeah, I can't get over it. I love that song. That is a good song right there. Yeah, that is a great song. Let's go. Yeah, Auntie M, I think you joined. Yeah, I think that's it. Is that you? 499? Yeah, all right. Uh, 1613 still. Kind of stuck here. Yeah, not really moving on either stock here. Maybe it's just because it's not updating on my end. Carve is up 19.7% for the day. Let's go. Yeah, let's go Carve. Yeah. Nice. Neo's up 3%. Yeah, Neo's up 3% for the day. That's good. Everything is up. Everything is green today. Yeah, so that's good. You guys aren't falling asleep on me, are you? Let's get some rockets in the chat. Rockets up in the chat if you're not falling asleep. If you're still with me, let's spam some rockets. Get this thing popping off. I'm still here. I'm still caffeinated. I'm still going. Matter of fact, let me finish this bang energy drink. Yeah, if you're still with me, let's throw some rockets in the chat. 
Yep. All right. Uh, 1612 on the ticker for Mavis. 1869 for Carve, right? So Carve is, uh, yeah, Carve is looking good. I'm surprised it moved this much with no volume. You can tell it's probably the banks, guys. There's just no volume here. Yeah, we have like less than 2 million, I think. Uh, on Carve, yeah, we have about 1.9 million. So not a lot. Not a lot. Still had some good movement, though. Yeah, okay. Uh, DD's up 4%. Nice. A lot of the hot pick stocks on the Discord are up right now. So, yeah, if you got in those, shout out to you. Yeah, you're making some money. Yeah, Nick Cordova, I see you with the emojis, man. I'm going to make you your own emoji, Nick. I swear to God. I'm going to make you the, the sickest emoji that only you can use. Nobody else will be able to use it. Just you. I need to use the restroom real quick, guys. If you guys don't mind waiting about uh, 60 seconds, uh, hang out. Don't leave. I will be right back. Why does it show zero watchers right now? I'm confused. Yeah, did you guys notice that? Yeah, it shows zero watchers. Yeah, I don't know why it's doing that. Yo, guys, you can actually see it right here live on the screen, too. You can actually click it right here as well. If you go to the actual video, it should be right below the like, the like button. Yeah, that join. You should be able to do it right there. So you actually don't have to go to my channel. You can actually just look to the right uh, underneath the like button. It sh there should be a join button right there for you. Yeah, for those of you that have DM me on Discord that can't figure it out. Yeah, it's right there. Uh, I need you to the restroom, so I will be right back, guys. Give me just a moment, all right?
1624, let's go. 1624, let's get it. Yes, I'm still here, guys. I'm still here. Yeah, she running. She running. Yeah, let's get it. Oh, my God. Yeah, she's running. Let's go. 1622 on the ticker right now for Mavis. 1820 for Carve. So Carve is having a little bit of a sell-off here. Yeah, but still looking good. Still looking bullish. For the short term. Yeah, still looking bullish. Yeah, let's go Carve. All right, all right, all right. MMAT, let's check it out. MMAT. Yeah, it's di uh, dipping a little bit here. Dipping a little bit. Back down to structure. Not the worst, not the worst thing, all right? So structure right here. All right, and it has dipped back down to structure. So hopefully we get a bounce like that for you guys. Yeah, like I said, I'm not in MMAT, but I have two call options which are likely to to fail for sure. <laughs> okay, Steve Alkier, thank you for coming to member, man. I appreciate you. Oh, doing the whole whale. Let's get it, man. We got another whale up in the group. Steve, thank you so much, my brother. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Yeah, I really do. Steve, uh, you get mod status for being a whale, so send me a DM on Discord, please, Steve, so I can hook you up with mod status. Uh, Nick Cordova, you're getting mod status, too. Yeah, we got this. Yeah, I got a bunch of whales living here. Thank y'all very much. Guys, do not feel obligated to do that, all right? That's just for people that want to support me and uh, in a monetary way, all right? You guys get some cool things with it, some cool perks. You can read the tiers. Uh, but really, it's just to help me out and hook me up, all right? I appreciate y'all very much. 1623 on the ticker for Mavis. We are above that 1622, guys. All right, you guys see how this breakout happened? Called it out perfectly. All right, this uh, little wedge, this little flag pattern right here, we broke out to the top side, and that kind of elevated us up. Now, we are probably going to get uh, this golden cross on the one hour here pretty soon. Uh, it's coming up, guys. The golden zone is in play, I promise you. I promise you, this golden zone is in play. You see the 50 SMA creeping up on the 200 SMA. That's what I'm talking about. Coming up right here. Gonna get across at some point. That's gonna take us to the golden zone. I I, I can't guarantee it, but uh, every sign in the world right now on this chart points to golden zone. So I think you're still likely if you want to get in here, you probably could make a nice little swing trade. Uh, you know, I'm not a financial advisor. Please understand that. But this is a good spot. Yeah, this is definitely a good spot. Yep. LKCO will have its day, Ben. I promise you. It will have its day. Yeah, it will be. Easily 50. Easily. Way more than that. I think I think LKCO could be 100 bucks plus. I really, really, truly believe that. I mean, can you imagine if smart cities really get going in China? I mean, imagine that. They always do everything better than us. They do it first. They do it better. I promise you. Like, if they start doing those smart cities like they're supposed to, uh, LKCO has gotten a government contract to map them out using EMAP Go. All right? I promise you. Like, yeah, LKCO is going to be a good stock. Whether it's 50 or 500, it's you're still going to make money on it. Yeah, NEO as well. NEO is going to be a good one for sure, especially if they keep expanding, all right? Oh, my gosh. Roman needs some attention. Jeez Louise. What's up, man? What's up? Why you look all mad? Yeah, there you go. All right, he got a hug and a kiss. Freaking Roman. Yeah, freaking Roman. They did the Corona before us. <laughs> nice. Nice. Touche. Yeah, touche, Lori. Two freaking Shea. Yeah, all right, Mavis, 1617 on the ticker. Let's go. I just want to see us close above 1622 for the day. Five more cents. Can we just close? Yeah, I don't mind. Three cents, actually. As long as we close above 1622 for the day, I am happy. I will be a happy camper. Yeah, for sure. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yep, I will be a happy camper. Yeah, 1623. Let's see. Yeah, let's see. Let's see. Yeah, trading view is lagging today. It usually doesn't lag this bad. Yeah, but it is lagging today. Weeble updates pretty pretty good. So yeah, uh, Weeble shows uh, Microvision at sixteen twenty one right now. That's what Weeble's showing it at sixteen twenty. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, no, it doesn't look bad at all. It looks good. Very bullish. Never been more bullish on Mavis actually. Yeah, so that should say a lot. 
If I, if I of all people have never been more bullish on Mavis, that should say something because I was bullish as crap even back here at ten dollars. <laughs> I was bullish down here. I was bullish up here. I was bullish down. I mean, really, I've never been more bullish on this stock. Yeah, I'm being dead serious. Yeah, this is this is a this is a freaking gold mine. Yeah, this is a freaking gold mine, my friends. I think I'm at about 3,000 3, shares, I think. Something like that. I have to go back and check. I got two accounts, so I have to add them up. But I think it's something like 3,000. Yeah, something like that. I could be wrong. I really need to go add it up because I don't know. I know I just bought 60. I just bought 60 on Cash App. Yeah, it cost me 1,028 bucks or something. Yeah, I have quite a few shares now. Yeah, quite a few shares. Maybe it's a little less. Maybe it's like 2700 or something. Yeah, uh, my biggest position is Microvision, guys. Yeah, that is my largest position. Yeah, right? I got about 75000 total in the market. Uh, Mavis is my biggest hold. All right? Yeah, that's my biggest hold. All right. Yeah, let's see here. Uh, let's see. 1623 on the ticker. We are above 1622 as far as trading view is concerned. So that's good. Yeah, that's really good. Mavis will be my largest investment until it happens, all right? Yeah, until it pops off, I will that this can be my largest hold. Yeah, for sure. I am out. I'm pretty much tapped out of dry dry powder right now on these accounts, so yeah, we need this to pop off. And it will. It will. Guys, if I didn't sell up here, yeah, look at this. If I didn't sell up here, Somebody was asking me why I'm not taking profits. Why would I take profits at $16? Why? Why would I? I didn't even take profits at $28, right? If I didn't take profits at $28, I'm definitely not taking it at $16, right? You got to understand the logic behind it. Like if I didn't take, I didn't take profits at $24, I didn't take profits at $10, I didn't or take a loss at $10, I didn't take profits at $28, I'm damn sure not taking the profits at $16. $16. This is a, a this is worth much much more. This stock is so undervalued. It's not even funny. They just have to do what they got to do, and you got to look at the implied value, right? If you're looking at the implied value of Microvision, that is where the value lies, my friends. All right, implied. You got to look at the future. You can't be looking right now at market cap and share price and you know whatever. Even though it doesn't even look that bad. Look how much money they have in the bank, right? They have liquid cash, right? This company is doing the right things. It costs money to run a company, especially one that's doing uh, stuff like this. It's not cheap. Running a tech company is expensive as crap. All right, it costs money. So yes, of course they're blowing their money. It costs money to run a company like this. Yeah, okay. So, but implied value, that's where the value lies in Microvision. And I'm just waiting for this thing to pop off so I can tell all these bears that come on the YouTube, haha, I told you so. Yes, all right, so let's get it. <clears throat> yeah, why not take profit and buy back in on the dip? That's exactly what I did, my friend. That is exactly what I did. I took profit up here. I took a little profit. I took like eight or 9,000 profit up here, waited for the dip and put it back in down here at 1222, right before this rip. That's exactly what I did. Yeah, anyways, um, yeah, no, that, like I said, definitely not hating on, uh, you know, selling some up here and putting it back in at the bottom. That's never a bad deal. Yeah, if I'd have been doing that the whole time, I'd I'd make a freaking killing. But I just went super long on it, so I didn't take prof any profits up here. Mainly because if if I did take profits up here, I would have just took the whole thing out, right? Uh, but I didn't. I, I kind of wish I would have because I would have just put it all back in down here. But uh, it you know didn't play out that way, and that's fine. That's fine. Yeah, because it's gonna take off at some point. I was originally in at seven twenty or something before its first run. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's what's up. We got 98 people in here. Thank you guys for joining. If you can, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Trying to get to 5,000 subs. Uh, we're almost 50%. Yeah, we're almost fit, about 45.26% on the way. Yeah, okay. Joseph Yoon's printing calls. Let's get it. Yeah, let's go. Let's freaking go. Yep. Guys, uh, someone's still getting a bunch of DMs about it. If you want to join the YouTube family, there are three tiers of membership at this point. Uh, just go to my channel or go to the stream. Look to the right here on uh, yeah on, the, on my channel on my channel real quick. 
I know you guys can see this, I think. Yeah, you should be able to see this. Uh, right here, there's a join button. You click this and it should just open that right up and you can choose what tier you wanna support me with, all right? Like I said, do not feel obligated to do this. This is just for y'all to show off and for the ones that really wanna support me monetarily and uh, you know help me out in life. So if you wanna do that, I would appreciate it. If not, just stay around, hang out, hit that like button. I'm okay with that. If that's all you wanna do, that's completely fine. And that's actually really good for me. Just hit that like button, that's all I ask. Uh, ben says, I got burned on my last call option on Mavis. Yeah, depends on when you get it, man. This It was not a bad spot to get some calls uh, after that earnings, it really wasn't. Yeah, definitely probably printing on those. Pitbulls grab some call options, nice. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. MMAT, uh, yeah, recovery nice off this little dip. Back to 362 on the ticker for uh, MMAT. Uh, yeah, so not looking too bad there for MMAT. Nice little rip. Hopefully it continues. Yeah, y'all are about to get a golden cross here on this 15. Also on the 30 coming up in the one hour. Yeah, not looking like a golden cross in the one hour, but the 15 and the 30, definitely gonna get this cross. And both these are, are headed towards the upside. You get a cross like that, looking pretty, pretty bullish. Yeah, so I hope you guys uh, recoup that, recoup those losses. All right, Mavis 1633, let's go. We're ripping, we're ripping. 1633 for Mavis, let's go. Oh my God, we are popping off here. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, I'll get some rockets in the chat from Mavis. Don't feel, don't be shy. Don't be shy, spam those rockets. Take your frustrations out on my chat. Throw whatever freaking emojis you want in there. But let's get some emojis popping off for Mavis, guys. It's really popping off. 1633, we are making our way to that golden zone. Might even happen today. Never know. Never know. All I know is if we close above 1622, that is going to be insanely bullish. And I think that for sure, we at least on a bare minimum come up and test this golden zone. All right, we're about to, we haven't even had the golden cross yet. One hour time frame golden cross coming up uh, here pretty soon. Might not see it today, but you'll probably likely see it tomorrow or the next day. Uh, 30 minute time frame. We just had the golden cross. Let's get some, some rockets for that too. We just had a golden cross on the 30 minute time frame for Mavis. Expect a nice little run here, all right? I expect a nice little run off this golden cross right here. Let's get it. Oh my God. I'm excited. Yes, I am. If you guys followed this trade blindly and you got in down here when I called this breakout out, shout out to you. Shout out to you for uh, doing something dumb and profiting. <laughs> Don't follow me blindly, guys. Do not do it. Uh, do your DD, do your own research, but know that when I made this call out, I told you guys, probably gonna bounce off this trend line. If we break to the top side, it's freaking on. And look what's happened, it's on. 16.38 on the ticker. 18.40 is two dollars and two cents away. Let's freaking go. Oh my God, we're so close. We're so close. <laughs> We're so close. Oh, please get us to the golden zone. I need I need to get up in that golden zone. I want to be in there. Let me get up in that thing. What's up, Golden Monkey? I appreciate you, brother. Thank you for the comment. Love your energy, James. Uh, ben, you can thank the Bang Energy Drink for that. 300 milligrams of caffeine flowing through my blood right now. Oh, my God. Lit mode, James. Lit mode, James. Yes, I need to be in this. Let me get up in that. <laughs> yeah, let's go. There you go. Rocket times infinity. I like it. Cassie Garden. I like it. Yes, let's go. We're doing this. We're really doing this. It's really happening, guys. I know we waited a long time. You've been following this channel. We've had a rough two months, but we're finally ripping here. All right. Finally, after this huge, huge downtrend here. Crazy, crazy downtrend. Yeah, it's just crazy. Yeah, all the way down back here on June 10th. All right. Wow. This was a long time ago. Yeah, this feels like a long time ago. June 10th. Two months. It's been two months of a downtrend, guys. Finally, we're breaking out. And what happens when we break out on these bigger time frames? You guys see these rips. You see these gigantic rip, ripperoni sandwiches. You guys want a ripperoni sandwich? You ever had one of those? You're having it right now if you're in Mavis. You're eating a ripperoni sandwich, right? Meow.
Joseph Yoon says, hey James, given that Mavis really respects certain price points, wouldn't you suggest buying a straddle at 1930 area? If it breaks, if it breaks, yes. Yeah, if it breaks, yeah. You're the options player, I don't play many options, so I think by straddle, I think you mean like, kind of like getting in a call option and a put at the same, with the same time, right? I think that's kind of what a straddle is. Yeah, I mean, I, I see what you're saying. I think that's what that is, where you, you, you kind of hedge your bet with both. Uh, but yeah, I mean, if it breaks that 1932, definitely, man. That's If we break 1932, a close above golden zone is probably inevitable. And like I said, I already called this out. So guys, don't forget this. I've said it many times. If we break and close on a higher time frame, like a one hour or a four hour above this golden zone, above 1990, really, 19, about uh, pretty much above 20 bucks, there go there's going to be a new ATH. All right, this is going to be the rip that does it takes us over 28 bucks maybe you know i don't know how far we can go because it's uncharted waters right but i think if we close above golden zone we gonna we're gonna make a run here it's gonna be everywhere all over wsb all these people are gonna get in it's gonna create fomo there are all the scanners are gonna be going off which they already are this thing is really gonna is gonna rip here all right so i think a new ath is in play with this and ethereum by the way ethereum's popping off too Yeah, straddle on the button. <laughs> yeah, straddle on the button. Anything's possible, James Jones. A freaking $100 is possible. I just hope we rip, man. Yeah, I hope we rip. If it stays around Golden Zone, then we lose money, but we know that the Golden Zones are just walls and price moves violently which other way. Yeah, sometimes. Yeah, sometimes it does. Eight twenty sixteen dollars $16 strike. You're in the money right now. Yeah, I hope you I hope you win that Pitbulls. That's a good that's a good little short term call option, I think. Yeah, I like sixteen dollars. Steve Alk here. I remember when this was one twenty eight last August. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, me too, man. I remember looking at this stock too. I just didn't get in until December, so I just you know yeah I w I wish I would have gotten in back when I was looking at this stock first. It was like a dollar. Yeah, it was crazy. Yeah, absolutely crazy. Crazy movement. Yeah, it really is, man. 1632 on the ticker for Mavis. MMAT up a couple cents, 364. Let's check AMC. Yeah, AMC still trucking along in this golden zone, kind of finding some dynamic support the way down on the way down this 50 SMA. Uh, yeah, like I said, it's a coin flip now with AMC, guys. Either it breaks out to the top side, or I feel like it breaks out to the bottom side. The bottom side here is $20. I think the wall uh, is probably down here at 20 bucks. There's there's another one here about 2550. All right, so there is one wall in here about 2550. Yeah, but if it breaks golden zone here, I really feel like twenty dollars is probably in play. If it breaks the top side, I don't know how far we can go. It's gonna have to create some demand, right? We gotta have people buying the stock to really make it move. Everyone's just holding right now, so yeah, we will see. Rick Dotson says Yahoo upgraded Mavis to green arrows on short, mid, and long term. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, let's do it. Nick Cordova. The non-smoking signs. <laughs> so random. <laughs> yeah, Nick, I see you, man. <laughs> Jamie, I see. I just got your cash app, Jamie. If you're listening, thank you so much. Jamie just sent 100 bucks to the cash app. Let's get some rockets for her. Yes, Jamie, thank you so much. Says lurking, but still love my Mavis fam. All right, that's what she said. Lurking, but still love my Mavis fam. Thank you, Jamie. I appreciate you very, very, very much. Thank you. Yeah, you help out a lot with that. Thank you so much. Yeah, all right. Let's see. Uh, let's get it. 1628. A little sell off off that 1638. 10 cents. Nothing. Nothing. No, no big deal. We're still above 1622. Yeah, we need to hold this. I'm going to go down to like a five minute and see what's going on. We need to hold above 1622. All right. So, yeah, the 30 minute time frame has four minutes and 55 seconds left all right so i would love to see a close on this 30 minute candle above 1622 that is what i'm hoping for uh a close above 1622 on the 30 minute on the 30 minute time frame right check rsi real quick rsi still looking good a little overbought now uh up here about 73 and a half on the rsi so technically this is overbought so maybe we get a dip i don't know but we just need to hold above 1622 that is key yeah that is the key Apple reportedly in talks with Korean EV component makers for Apple Car. Yeah, I think people were talking about that before. An Apple Car, that's crazy, man. Yeah, that's, these conglomerates are insane. These huge megacorps just, man. 
They all do the same thing, really. It's just a matter of which, which one you like. Are you Android? Are you Apple? Uh, you know, are you Ford? Are you Chevy? Oh, man. I had to get a good stretch in there. Ooh, that felt good. Jeez. Yeah, that was a nice one. Yeah, all right. Um, right. Let's see. They also announced adding LiDAR to Apple Car back in, on July 15th. That's pretty good news, actually. Yeah, LiDAR is becoming known. Not a lot of people know about LiDAR, but LiDAR is becoming known for sure. Yeah, it really is. I didn't even know about LiDAR until I found until I found Mavis. So I know most people don't know about it. Let's check Vintel for Microvision. Yeah, let's see where we're at. All right. Oh, man, my jaw's getting all sore and freaking tired from talking. Yeah, short interest here. 500,000 on Mavis. Yeah, they might be closing up here. Hopefully we start to see them closing the millions. That's what we're trying to see. Two, three, four, five million. Yeah, shorts available. That's what we're trying to see here. Yeah, for Mavis. Mavis still has squeeze potential, guys, all right? This even wasn't, this wasn't really a squeeze here. This was just like all these rips up to like 24, 25, 30 bucks. That's not a squeeze. The shorts could really cover here. This thing could really actually squeeze. I know we were talking about it a couple months ago, how this thing could just really squeeze up to like 200, 300 bucks in an instant. It really could still do that. Yeah, there's still a lot of a very high short interest and we own a, a, a large percent of the float. So yeah, like I said, this could actually squeeze. I mean, I'm not saying it's going to happen, but it could. It's got squeeze potential for sure. Yeah, definitely. Elon knew about LiDAR and said, no, we're not going to use that. Yeah, and then he came back and said he wanted it, right? <laughs> exactly. Yeah, freaking Elon. That guy's a clown. I don't like that guy. Yeah, I don't like that guy. Nick Cordova, you look good in green. <laughs> yeah, you do, Nick. You look good in green. We all look good in green. Yeah, except uh, Dwangus. He likes to be in red. Dwangus loves red. Where is Dwangus? That guy loves to be in the red. He shorted Mavis. <laughs> what a dumb dumb. Yeah, what a big dumb dumb head. Yeah, about roughly 20% of the flow, a 20% uh, of the flow is short. Yeah, which is actually pretty high. So, uh, Binkley McGee, yes, around 20% of the float is shorted on Microvision. So, like I said, could easily trigger a squeeze here. Yeah, if they start closing. Yeah, I agree. I think the camera system and lighter together would be perfect. I mean, both systems uh, combined seems like the best play to me. Don't skimp out on it, you know? Yeah, Microvision comes with the cheapest, best LiDAR. I mean, it's for price point, it does more than all the other LiDARs, and it's cheaper. So yeah, just throw it in your Tesla, Elon. Drop 10 bill, let's get it. Let's get it popping. I'll become an Elon fan if he buys uh, the LiDAR vertical for 10 billion. I'll be happy. Yeah, <laughs> I will. 1625 on the ticker so a little sell-off still above that 1622 we got 50 seconds left guys 50 seconds on this candle can we get some rockets flowing let's try to manifest this i'm gonna draw my arrow you guys throw some rockets and we'll manifest this thing together all right we got to close above 1622 not that that guarantees us movement but it definitely shows strength if we close above key levels all right so we close above 1622 it's gonna show some strength let's get some rockets flowing in the chat diamonds whatever you want custom emojis hearts cactuses non-smoking signs people faces whatever let's get them flowing in the chat yeah nobody nobody wants r2d2 on top of their car <laughs> no right yeah freaking velodyne velodyne sounds like some some cream you gotta use for something if you know what i'm saying <laughs> oh my god yeah let's get it <laughs> the red rocket <laughs> the pink rocket yeah the pink rocket there we do we did it yes this candle guys this candle closed real nice hell yeah this candle closed at 1632 let's go Woo! we're breaking these key zones like it ain't nothing we might see a dip here that's fine we still closed above 1622 that shows strength yeah that shows some damn strength if you ask me we got 103 people in here thank y'all for being here Hit that subscribe button, guys. Help me get to my 5,000 subscriber mark. We got about 55% to go. All right, we're 45% on the way there. Trying to get to 5,000 subs. Yeah, you want to help me out? Hit that subscribe button, all right? I would love R2-D2. Beep, boop, beep. Master Luke. Yeah, the LiDAR is ready. 
I wonder if R2D2 uses LiDAR. Do you think do you think R2D2 and uh do you think they use LiDAR? Yeah, I feel like he does use LiDAR. Balloons, let's go. Yep, yep, let's go. I'm going to create a bot to help you with those subs, James. Uh don't do that, please, because they check it out. This is actually a real thing. I want to somebody actually was gonna do that for me. Don't do that because YouTube can demonetize my channel if they see a bunch of fake subs. So like if when somebody hates somebody on YouTube, what they do, this is a real thing by the way. They hire a company like you can go pay for subs, right? You can pay to have fake subs on your channel. I haven't done that. I would, never would. But if you they spam them with those bots and so they get them like 20,000 subs and and uh, YouTube picks up on the algorithm and it demonetizes their channel. So you can actually screw someone over by doing that. So I appreciate you but please don't do that. <laughs> I want to keep this channel. I love this channel. I don't want to do that. Yeah, but yeah, there's been horror stories of people that have been streaming on YouTube and just being on YouTube in general and someone that doesn't like them comes along and spends like 50 bucks on one of those bots and has their channel spanned with new subs that are not real and it screws up their uh yeah, it screws up their their monetization. So, I don't know. I just don't want to mess with it. Hopefully that never happens to me. If it does, I'm going to Twitch. Yeah, so just know that. If it does, I'm going to Twitch. Plus, you know what? I'd like it to be, I'd like to get natural growth. You know, I'm just one of those people, like, I don't care about the way it looks. I don't care about all that. Like, I'm totally fine with where we're at, but I want that natural growth, right? I want people that are actually going to be watching the stream and, and interacting to be the ones that are subscribing to my channel. That's like, that's kind of what I'm after, so. All right, a little sell-off here. Back down to 16, 18. Likely a uh, nice double top here. That's not good for the short term. You got a double top. We might see a dip down to structure again. This double top usually indicates uh, some a lot of sell pressure, all right? This is a little bit bearish on the short term to see a double top like this. We didn't really want to see this, but yeah, it is what it is. We got to ride through the wave. 16, 15 on the ticker. RSI super overbought, by the way, guys. So we need price to hold up while RSI dips. We are currently under 70, right about 69 on the RSI. Not too shabby, but we need to hold. We need price to hold up above. Really, at this point, now that there's a double top forming, we need it to hold up above 1607. All right, we really need to hold up above structure here. Yeah. Oh no, Ben. I appreciate you, brother. I appreciate you. Yeah, I appreciate you. Rick Dotson says Twitch would be cool. I have an Amazon free subscription that will throw you five dollars a month. Nice, nice. Yeah, you can do that on YouTube too. At this point, I opened up those memberships, so I, all you got to do is go to this channel right here, click join. You can you can do the same thing here. So yeah, that'd be cool. Yeah, that would be cool. Sixteen fifteen on the ticker. Yeah, let's find some support here. We'll drop back down to a fifteen minute time frame. Yeah, Weiwei, are you listening, Weiwei? Help us, said, help us, Summit Sharma. You're our only hope. <laughs> yeah, really, he needs to do something. Yeah, take us to the promised land, Summit. Take us up to that $40. That'd be perfect. All right, nice. Found some uh, found some support here at this structure. Yeah, right in the middle of the zone. So we're bouncing off this uh, 1615, basically. Yeah, RSI is kind of dipping here. That's good. We need RSI to cool off while price holds up. That's what we're looking for. Yeah, and so there's some uh, there's definitely some strength here in this move. Yeah, right. We did close on the previous candle above 1622, and there's still 10 minutes left on this candle for this candle to do the same thing. So 10 minutes to go on this candle. We would love to see this one close back above 1622 as well. Maybe even above uh, 1638. Yeah, that's the goal. The close above the previous candle. Yeah, that's always the goal, right? So we got some, we got some, some movement. We need, we need some movement, but we could do it. Yeah, we could definitely do it. Take us to the summit, summit. More rockets and arrows. Why does my arrow keep disappearing? Yeah, I feel like it's because it's on the higher time frame. There it is. Yeah, there we go. There's the rocket. Let's get it. We're going to put this on the 15. Yeah, right here on the 15. Maybe if I draw this in, we'll we'll spike back up. Let's go. Yes, to the upside.
Yeah, Nick, I see you. Sandra, I see you guys. Let's go. Yeah, let's make it happen. Come on, Mavis. AMC kind of ripping here a little bit. Uh, 33.51 on the ticker for AMC. Uh, kind of just chilling in between these SMAs. All right, so need a, need a 50 to cross over the 200 on uh, AMC. I still don't know if that's actually going to make it go up, but we'll see. I still think a dip is in play for AMC. Yeah, I really do. Ninety-three people watching. Yeah, let's get it. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, who's gonna be the next one to join the team on disc on YouTube? Yes, yeah, shows right here. Steve Alkier was the was the last one. Yeah, before that, Sandra and then Nick. Yeah, let's go. Let's do it. Yeah, right. Uh, let's see here. Nick, did you just erupt in your pants? <laughs> it happens. It happens, man. <laughs> yeah, nice. Uh, Renault partners with Geely in China, South Korea. Big news for LKCO. Yeah, that actually is. Yeah, let's go LKCO. Let's go LKCO. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm messing up here. If you guys are in the Discord, guys, do me a favor. If you're in the Discord, let's just keep the chats flowing, right? Post whatever you want. Use the channels, talk to people, make friends, play, uh, you know, this is supposed to be like a community of funness, right? Like, a uh, community of traders like to have fun together and make money. So go in the casino channel. Play tic-tac-toe with each other. I know I played a few games with a few of you. Tic-tac-toe, uh, what else is there? There's a lot of games you guys can play with each other. So get up in that, have some fun. Talk in the channels, you know, someone posting the real estate channel. I made that because I'm gonna start doing some real estate stuff here pretty soon. So if you guys are interested in that, uh, check back for that. But there's a lot of channels in here now you can talk in. So make sure you're, you know, you paid to be in the members area. Let's use it, let's make it, let's make it worth it. Let's make it pop off, right? Yeah, let's see here. Uh, let me see. Sandra Lay's posting Barbies. I like it. I like it. 1614 on the ticker for Mavis. Little sell off here. Nothing crazy. Uh, we're back down to structure, back in the zone, trying to bounce off here. Yeah, hopefully it happens. Yo, the, check this out. I'll do a little challenge for you guys. Uh, if you're on the team right now, Go to Discord, go to the Casino channel, all right? It's right below your pets, post your pets. Go to the Casino channel. The first person to run their stack up to a million, I'm going to send you 50 bucks. I'm going to send you $50, all right? You got to run it up to a million, though. Yeah, you got to run up to, and I'm watching. Yeah, I'm watching. So you can't buy the credits, and I will know. I run the bot, so I know who buys gems and who doesn't. If you run it up to a million, I'm going to send you 50 bucks. Yeah, so try to do it. I ran mine up to 100,000 and then lost it all. So, yeah, the first person to run their credits to a million without buying gems, I'm going to see 50 bucks on Cash App. Yeah, right? 50 bucks on Cash App. First person to hit a million in credits in the casino channel, you're getting 50 bucks from me. Yeah, right? A little challenge there for you. Yeah, you could just bet it all. Put it all on black. That's what I would do. <laughs> You could run it up real quick. You just got to win a few coin flips. That's it. Yeah, win a few coin flips. You'd be at a million in no time. Easy 50 bucks. Yeah, $50 to the first person in the Discord that runs their credit roll up to a 1 million in credits, all right? I know it sounds like a lot. Yeah, but it's really not. I ran 5,000 up to 100,000 the other night, like in like 30 minutes. So yeah, you won't have that much trouble. Shouldn't be that hard. Guys, my Chick-fil-A salad just arrived. Give me one second. I got to set this bad boy up. This is the best part. I got to set it up. Give me one second.
Guys, I'm gonna take a five minute break, all right? Hold on. I'm gonna take a five minute break and I'm gonna scarf this salad down. You guys hang out, all right? Don't leave, hang out. I'm still gonna keep streaming. I know a lot, it, matter of fact, if you want me to keep streaming through Power Hour, give me a thumbs up in the chat, all right? If you're gonna stick around, you want me to keep streaming through Power Hour, I'm gonna try to do it. Uh, give me a thumbs up in the chat. If that's the case, I am gonna take a five minute break, maybe 10 minutes and eat this salad uh because i'm really hungry all right so if you want that to happen thumbs up in the chat don't leave stick around uh hang out watch the ticker i'll leave it on but i'll be back as soon as i'm done eating all right I'm trying to eat this fast, guys. I'm almost done. I see the dip here, it's fine. We have this double top, right? Uh, double top right here. Likely to see a dip off this price action, and we did. All right, but uh, looks like we're recovering here, back to 15.99. Almost done eating, give me just a few more moments, all right?
Yeah, all right, guys, I'm back. Dang, I ate that salad so fast. All right, yeah, I'm back, I'm back. Let's get it. So Mavis had a sell-off, all right? Yeah, standard. Uh, I kind of expected this when I saw this double top form. Uh, thumbs up in the chat if you guys heard this. When I saw this double top, I said we'd likely come back down to structure. We went a little bit further than I wanted to, but we're back above $16 now. 1607 on the ticker, and I am full, so let's get it. Yeah, let's get it. Yeah, what's the 50 and the, and the 200 look like? Let's pull it up. Yeah, let's pull it up. They're down below us. Yeah, they're way down below us. Here's your 50 and here's your 200. Yeah, so, yeah, super bullish looking. Yeah, super bullish. Just had that golden cross on the one hour time frame. Likely going to reflect here after this uh, recovery, if we recover. Uh, likely going to have a, a move to the upside off this golden cross right here on the one hour time frame. So, yeah, looking pretty good in the short term. Had a sell off larger than I would have liked. Yeah, but it is it is what it is. Came right down to the top of this trend line and bounced off. Currently dipping again, 1603 on the ticker. We did close above 1622, all right? So this candle still has some time left. It's got about eight minutes left to get back up there. Yeah, right. a lot of people ask me on DM. Uh, I'll just say it again. Uh, if you want the stock symbol next to your name or anything next to your name on the chat, yeah, you have to be a member on YouTube, right? There's a way to do that. You go to my channel and uh, go right here. And yeah, you can click join right here next to my name under the like button. Or you can go to my actual channel and do subscribe through there. Right? It's different than Discord. It is 100% a separate thing from Discord. You have to go to the YouTube channel and choose which tier you want. You click join. All right, there's three tiers here, okay? Yeah, $3.99, $8.99, and the whale, which is $49.99. But do not feel obligated to do any of those. If you want to support me monetarily, that's kind of the way to do it. All right? Uh, it's right there on the channel for you to do it. I just answered it, answered it a few times, but I went over it again. You just have to go to my channel and find that button that says join. Click members, and then you can choose your tier that you want to support. All right? Uh, 16 dollars on the ticker for Mavis. Not bad. Not bad. Still over $16. Got to keep that in mind. We're still over 16 bucks. This is a standard lunch sell-off. Sounds about right. Probably power hour. We might see a little rip. We did just have that golden cross on the one hour time frame. I'm sorry, on the 30 minute time frame. Uh, 30 minute time frame, we had a golden cross. So yeah, price probably will reflect that. It's going to take a second to kick in, but I think it will do it. I think it will reflect it. All right, that's just my opinion. <laughs> Yeah, you're in the family, Ben. Yeah, you're definitely in the family, my friend. Yo, Mavis is actually reflecting this. Look at the Discord, guys. I like this bot. It reflects Mavis. I have to pay. I have to use the paid version to get all these stocks to do this. I was just testing it out. I think I will pay for it. Um, but yeah, you can see Mavis, the stock ticker uh, channel for Mavis. Uh, you see the 1605 in the title uh, of the channel. It moves with the ticker, so that's cool. Yeah, I like that a lot. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it is uh yeah, it is moving with the with the stock as it moves. Yeah, all right. Yeah, let's see. Uh, LKCO $1.41. Yeah, so nice little uh movement on that today a little bit, I think. Yeah, let me see what we're up for the day on uh for LKCO. No, we're still down. I apologize. Yeah, we're still down for the day. Mavis is up 3.9%, AMC up 3%, Neo up 3%. And MMAT up 9%. Carve, what's Carve doing? 15%. We haven't checked Carve in a minute. Yeah, let me see what Carve is doing. Yeah, okay, a little sell-off on Carve. Yeah, a little sell-off. Hoping to get back above that 1853 uh, area, or 63 area. Yeah, hopefully we can get above that and make another run. I would like to get unstuck on this. Yeah, I really would. Really, really would. I'm going to try to stream through, through for a little bit longer. I don't know if I can make power out, guys. I really want to. I don't know if I can. My voice is really, like, I'm starting to, like, what's the word? Like, my, my my voice box is starting to fatigue a lot. I don't know if I can make three more hours. I really don't. Yeah, it's starting to, I don't want to wear it out too much, and then I can't talk tomorrow. Yeah, so I don't know if I can do it. Uh, let's see here. SMA's looking good. Yeah, SMA's looking real good. 
Yeah, let me check some real fast. Yeah, let's see. Uh, yeah, let's see what's going on here on the YouTube. Yeah, yeah, I see it there. Yeah, okay, uh, yeah, let's see here. We got seven people that have joined the YouTube uh, support. Nice. Yeah, I appreciate y'all. Yeah, thank you very much. Carve 1829 on the ticker. Yeah, I would love to see Carve get back up above this, uh, like I said, this 1863 level. Yeah, I want to get unstuck on Carve. Yeah, I don't even mind about the squeeze. I just want to get unstuck. Yeah, or take a break now and come back at 2.30. Yeah, it'll be 2.30 for me. Yeah, I can do that. Whatever you guys want. Uh, yeah, if you want me to take a break and come back for power, I can do that. Or we could, uh, you know, yeah, just stream as long as I possibly can. Yeah, you know. Yeah, one second. All right, yeah, we're here. All right, 83 people in here. Smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. I'm surprised we haven't had more subs today. Yeah, I thought we would. Yeah, if you haven't done it already, hit that subscribe button on my channel. Hit that notification bell to get notified when I go live. I think it's best if I take a break and come back, to be honest with you. Yeah, this is kind of just stuck here. We're just kind of just chilling around in this zone. I think it's probably better if we take a break and come back. It'll help my voice, and it'll just help me have some more energy for Power Hour, right? I don't mind doing it. Yeah, so uh, I think that's probably what I'm going to do. Thumbs up in the chat if it's okay with you. If I take a break, it's up to you guys. <laughs> Hopefully you allow it. Yeah, because I need a little I need a little break here. Uh, my voice is kind of fatigued and it's kind of just hurting to talk at this point. Um, we've been streaming for about... How long have we been streaming here? Yeah, where does it say? I have been streaming for four hours already. Four hours. Four hours, all right? I'm going to take a quick break, guys, I think. And uh, yeah, I'll be back for power hour at 2.30. So two hours from right now... Come back to this channel. As soon as you get in here, smash that like button. Give me some rockets, and we're going to start Power Hour. Uh, actually, at 2 o'clock. I apologize. So an hour and a half from now. Yeah, okay. Hour and a half. Go get you guys some food. Hit a workout. Take your dog out. Take a shower. Chug a bottle of whiskey. Whatever you do during the day. <laughs> whatever you do during the day, do that. And come back for Power Hour. I will be here. All right? Uh, 2 o'clock Central Standard Time. So an hour and a half from now, all right? Let's get it. Let's get it. All right. Appreciate y'all very much for all the super chats, all the members. If you guys are trying to do the member thing, go figure it out. Hit that join button. I would appreciate it. Uh, and I will see you guys on Discord. The rest of you, I will see you at 2 p.m. for Power Hour, right? Peace and love from my end. Trade Mo James signing out. See you guys at 2. Let's get it.